So what? So basically, what happened is Game Familiar shown up, and the first thing we do is push him into a hole. <laughs> we're like, who, wait, the, wait, who wait, the fuck wait, are you? Wait, <laughs> get down that hole! Greetings from Bermuda, this is BD Alarming, and welcome to Across the Obelisk. And tonight we are going to be playing co-op with my friend Fatid. Fatid, how are you doing? Yeah, I'm not too bad. How are you? I am doing all right, thank you. Uh, all right, so we've, we, we've done a brief test to make sure uh, we kind of vaguely know what we're doing. Uh, but uh, neither of us have played this co-op before, so uh, we're still kind of figuring out a little bit as we go. Uh, but it seems fairly straightforward. Uh, basically, rather than one person having to worry about everything, uh, we can split duties on that. The host of the game gets to choose uh, which slots they want to be responsible for. Um, which they want the other players to be responsible for. Uh, and then uh, you can uh, drag and drop whatever characters you like. We've kind of uh, pre-agreed I'm going to take Magnus uh, at the front and Reginald at the back. And then Fatheed's going to do Andrin and Evelyn. Where should we go? Where should we go? I, d I don't know. Which, which way? Let's go that way. That seems like a good idea. Okay, so I got some rewards from my last game, uh, which is kind of cool. So playing it single player, multiplayer, doesn't really matter. It just kind of mixes it all together. Uh, so I'm going to claim those rewards now for this run, uh, which should give us a decent advantage, I guess. Um, are you going to like buy anything? Like, I don't really know what we should yes, do at the beginning. I mean I'm in the armory at the moment. Okay. Uh, that's normally the first place that uh, equipment. Yeah, that seems that decent. Actually. Yeah. Um, although you do have different equipment to what I do, which is good and bad, I guess. Right. Oh, because well, I, I have one set of equipment to pick from. Do you have a completely different set of equipment then? I have like a I'm... completely different set of equipment to pick from. Oh, okay. So I've got uh, garnet earrings, club, dirty bandages, opal ring. Yeah, I have. I have the ominous hourglass of death. Oh, weird. Okay. Sick tablet, small pouch. Can I buy um, stuff for you then? No, I think in the top left above the party, we can give golden shards, but that's it. I don't think we can. Ah, uh, okay. You can do equipment. However, I have. This is one thing I didn't ask about. I have unlocked a pet. Oh, very fast. I'm not sure how you feel about me bringing the pet. Bring your pets along, along that's fine. The ride. <laughs> it does. Anything that helps cast, us. It casts clairvoyance every round, which is basically one stack of. Sight? Yes, and okay. another one. I'm not very good at this. Can't remember very well. But uh, yes, it will. It will help, of course. Okay. Cool. Um, all right. Shall be as quick as I can. Combat end. Okay. Dirty bandages. Doesn't somebody start with dirty bandages anyway? Reginald uh, does. Reginald oh no, he starts with combat bandage. bandages. Yes. All heroes recover three hit points. I could buy dirty bandages for somebody else to recover two hit points for all heroes at combat end, which will be five between us. Which sounds like that might be useful. What slot does that go in? That kind of goes in the potion slot. I can put that in for Magnus. So you know what? I like to go for fire builds on um, on Evil Ember, but I'm not sure how you feel about about me doing that or whether yeah, you'd... Well, yeah, whatever you like. That's, that's cool. Yeah, just, uh, just go for it. Uh, all I've got is stuff that does resistance, extra uh, club damage. Yeah, these don't seem great. Who's the one who does sight? Is that Evelyn or is that Reginald? Reginald normally does sight. Okay. Uh, vision ring, all resistances plus two. Sight charges plus one. That might be a good thing for him to have then. Let's get him that. Uh, I'm going to get the bandages because... Extra healing for everybody seems good. Uh... 
Let's see what their resistances are. No. Uh, leather armor for Reginald. That might uh, for Magnus. That might make sense as well. I got a ton of my from my prior rewards, so I might as well use it. Yeah, yeah. Rub it in. Rub <laughs> it in. Make up for my terrible playing as well. Nothing. Uh, nothing will ever make up for that, I don't think. <laughs> uh, okay. I'm gonna uh, upgrading cards though may be nice as well. Healing rain. I like upgrading healing rain. But to to remove for um, all heroes or for? Uh, we could go either no. way. Yeah. I mean. Do we have any enemies that inflict fire in the first area? I don't think we particularly do, do we? We don't. My, see, my feeling on this is is really all, all that you're kind of gaining by upgrading it the other way. You don't get any extra healing, but all you're gaining is extra wet, wet. debuff. Which so is that's... useful for lightning stuff, right? Kitty Witch! Which is... <laughs> Hello! How are you? It's useful for the for the lightning stuff, but that, that's kind of it. Yeah, okay. Um, so, uh, and on top of that, it also prevents burn charges, which is what I'm going to be doing. Right, okay. So, oh yeah, and that's global then, okay. So upgrade it to just affect all heroes. That would be my preference. Yeah. That's normally what I go for. But... Okay, I'll do that. Any other upgrades you like to do at the beginning? Um, don't know. It's different, I guess, because I normally have to kind of spread everything out across all. Yeah, of yeah. This is another thing, right? Like the rewards from the last run I did. Now I'm just dividing between two characters rather than four. Just rolling, rolling in charges. Yeah, <laughs> I am. I got twelve hundred and fourteen charges. Just checking that your other half isn't giving me too much trouble. He's he's not giving me too much trouble, no. No, he's he's been alright, he's been well behaved. For now, I've only had uh only on at my second drink though. <laughs> I'm out of wine and the bottle's empty as well. I'll have to open another bottle if. How did if you, I how did you run drink. out of wine? Well this 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 was I mean, <laughs> this is the I mean, fourth night. Wine, but... This is the fourth night I've dragged out my one bottle of wine. Uh, until so, um, yeah. <laughs> See, Tiddy Witch normally likes to kind of drag out her, um, her alcohol. She certainly doesn't get as uh, she doesn't certainly, certainly doesn't pour her drinks as freely as I do. <laughs> but uh, she got a little bit carried away last night. But it's New Year, so why it's, not? Yeah, it's New Year. That's a lot. Why not enjoy yourself? That's that's true. <laughs> your your Christmas alcohol will last at least until your birthday in June. Fantastic. Genuinely will as well. <laughs> You're officially drying out right now, though. Yeah, I'm sure. Yeah, I had a very quiet New Year's last night. I I didn't drink anything, and I was I was almost in bed before midnight. Um, yeah. Uh, I don't know. I don't know what I want to upgrade, and it, it takes too long to faff around. So uh, why don't we? Why don't we just go? I mean, you can craft cards as well. You can. At the, That's true. I haven't done that. I didn't do that last time. At the Magic Forge. So yeah, it's, it's worth having a look at on on that side. Actually, hang on. Barricade. I like Barricade. Can I upgrade Barricade? Uh, wait. Where did I upgrade them again? There. See, I, I made the mistake last night of um, I made the mistake last night of drinking and not going to bed early, and then <laughs> being at work for nine a.m. Oh god, you were still up at like two a.m. or something, right? Because you were on the stream. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. That just sounds horrible. You, you, you can imagine how I've been feeling today. <laughs> I'm sure. Yeah. <laughs> here's, here's a rundown of the argument that we've had today. Tiddy Witch, can I cancel my overtime, please? No. Tiddy Witch, can I cancel my overtime now? No. <laughs> Got the lunch time. Tiddy Witch, you know how I've done half of my shift. Can I cancel my overtime now? 
<laughs> Tiddy no. Witch says you were up till 4 a.m. Oh my god, so you got like five hours sleep and had been yeah. drinking heavily and you did a 12 hour shift. Yeah. Okay, so so if we lose this game, it's all your fault. Right? Probably. <laughs> okay, I've upgraded Barricade. Uh, I've still got a ton of shards. I don't know. I'm going to keep them to upgrade better cards, I guess. Uh, craft cards, yeah, okay. Craft cards, you said we could do that. Would um, you be able to send me, if you're not going to spend it, could you send Oh, yeah, sure. Do you want some? Yeah, 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 yeah. 80... No, not 80... Yeah, 89 gold. 89 gold. 89 uh, gold. Uh, I, I could if I was going to click plus 20 four times and then plus one nine times, which I refuse to do, so I'm just going to give you 100. Oh, thank you very much. <laughs> Would you like any shards as well? I've got I got shards coming out my ears. No, I'm okay. I'm just going to buy some armor for, for Evelyn. Okay, cool. Then... Original craft. There you go, there's your 11 gold back. Oh, <laughs> thank you. All right, get change. Um, I don't know. There's too many cards, there's too many effects. It's too confusing. Uh, you, you don't want any shards? Quite... No, keep your shards, keep your shards. Okay. I, quite like thing, I quite like things like Dawnlight. Do okay, that was there um, actually. Hang on. Yeah, so damage equals your hand size plus. It's free. It's a free card. Is that the uh, hands? Okay, hand size rather than draw size. Oh, it's free. Mm -hmm. It's basically a free bit of damage. It's not bad, is it? It's not not too bad. Obviously, your hand size is is limited. But what I'm going to try and do with with Evelyn, where possible, is pick up cards like um, transmission. Okay. And um, things like that, which will allow you to give me extra card draw. Drop. Draw more cards. Okay. Um, and you're normally going to be going after me because it's normally going to go Andrew yeah. and Magnus, Evelyn, Reginald. Yeah. Okay. Uh, sure. Okay. I'll take Dawn Lightning. Sold. Gonna spend those shards on something. Right. Don't I lose? How much do you keep when you. Only like 10% or something, isn't it? It's pretty something bad. Something like that, yeah. 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 Um, I think so. What's this divination round? Have you ever done it? I don't have enough money so, for it so, now, but... so, so you know the, the thing that you get at the end of the game? At the end of a combat? Uh, oh, yeah, okay. Yeah, 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 yeah. That's basically all That's this. one of those. Okay, so you get to pick some... Everybody gets to pick yeah. a card, basically. So there's fast divination, and then there's basic divination, which costs more gold. And I'm assuming you kind of keep upgrading that. Right. And then... Yeah, so so looking at the town upgrades, you've got basic divination, um, advanced divination. Oh, uh, then... right. Okay. God, yeah, I haven't and even looked basic divination yet. Reduced cost and, and, and things. Right. Okay. Well, the, the one that I did pick, in fact, you've already got it, removing cards in the starting town is free. Right. Yeah. And just as a word of caution, re-rolling stuff in the shop in the armory is 600 gold. 600 gold? 600 gold. Jesus. We'll be doing that then. Okay. I think I'm ready. Let's go. Do you have any preference for the direction that we go? Uh, I went middle last time. I, how much is it randomized and how much is it... Uh, it like looks like so, it's the same, actually. So the combat's the same, but what happens is the... You've got certain things that are the same. So the, can you see these these ones with the exclamation marks? They're normally characters that yeah. you can unlock and they'll give you quests. Yeah. Yeah. You've so got, like the Wandering Wizard is the one that I got uh, yeah, you, last you've time. Got, you've, you've got your standard kind of colors um, to represent different things. So the book in the north is glowing green. Oh, yeah. And the gold pouch towards the center is glowing green as well which means they're kind of higher rarity events effectively, uh, okay all right it. okay so you, you you possibly kind of get a better outcome from right there's, from also, there, but... there's also suspicious hatch wait that's glowing kind of yellow is that like a legendary thing 
kind of. So the suspicious hatch is always there. Oh, is it? Okay. But it does allow you to unlock a pet, which I haven't done yet. Pet! All right, shall we go that way then? Yes, so to the North. corn. Onwards. Let's fight some corn on the cob. So yeah, so this is what it does. Insight. Oh, sorry, uh, sight okay. and um, insane. Wait, so what? So Andrin has the pet, is that right? I assume? Yes. Okay. Yes. What does his pet do? His pet casts. Can I right click on Andrin? Yeah, so, so his pet. I don't know if you can see. In fact, yes, if you go to his equipment, it'll tell you. Oh, okay, um, it's, yeah. It's under, it's under equipment, yeah. Right, so smashing Hockey. damage resistance plus 6%. And, and every, every turn, turn cast Clevoins. Okay, nice. So every turn it'll it'll cast that and then just an even that oh okay. Oh hello. Poison flask. I've no idea what so that what, what did I just cast there? Um deflect. Draw one card. I have no idea where that card even came from. Genuinely <laughs> got no idea where that card came from. That's not in your I deck. Mean, it's not in my deck. It's got Definitely like a padlock symbol deck. on it. What does that mean? I think that means it hasn't been unlocked. So, um, yeah, so I guess I'll pop this. Oh, I know what it is. I know what it is now. It was kind of from my deck. In a, Well, it's from my, my equipment, so I've got the small pouch. Which shuffles a small weapon into my into my deck. Oh wow! And that was my small weapon, twenty poison. <laughs> That's a pretty good weapon. Yes. <clears throat> All right. Uh, so what we're have we not got? in a bad. We're not in a bad start. We're not in a bad. No, what are they doing? Nine damage. Uh, okay. Uh, well, let's do. Let's kill him. Uh, let's. What are they doing? Nine damage. That's just two front hero. Okay. So uh, can you just defend and then? I well, I can defend for fourteen. Well, what I, what I would say is it's maybe worth defending for fourteen to do the extra damage because Reginald still takes his turn at the end. Okay. So the, the likelihood is you're probably going to be able to heal for. Damage. Okay. Um, oh. Oh no, this is you. So. I we'll can't play. This. Fireball. You gotta cast fireball. Surely. That's the rule. Can you kill that front one? Not quite. Or maybe. I can't see how much energy you've got, though, is the only thing. Hey, what, why don't you go first? That sounds even better. Um, mm. Mm, can't kill the. I mean, you can pop a barrier on. In fact, it doesn't matter now because Magnus is going to be. Oh, he's got enough block anyway, right? He's got enough block. He's so all we needy. need to do is get enough damage on him, and he'll die at the end of the turn, and we'll get the best reward from this. And nobody needs uh, heal anyway. Um, yeah, that no heal. Be that should be it, the right? Yeah. The poison's going to kill him. But at the end of his turn, yeah. Nice. Okay, wow, round one. Performance bonus, excellent. Achievement unlocked. Two achievements, Tracker and Theogist. Theogist? What even is that? 30 mage. I don't know what that is. Uh, unlock 30 mage cards, Tracker unlock 30 scout cards. Oh, I thought it was because we, we, we won in round one. You got excited there, didn't you? I did, yeah. I've never won in round one before. That's amazing. See, but I gotta bring you along and I start winning. Uh, I don't want to take. No, I'm, I'm, I'm thinking, is it worthwhile to take multi shot because it's three mana, 12 damage, one bleed? Four. Same. All monsters. all monsters. It seems pretty decent. I'm going to have to take it. Uh, scry 
phase upgraded, look at five cards, discard any of them. I can play that on anybody, which can be useful. Uh, Magnus. I would say remember that you can take shards, but... <laughs> I've got so many of those already. But at the same time, it's also worth considering if you don't want to take anything. It's better to take the shards than kind of dilute your deck. True. Uh, I don't know. What do you think about these cards? I'll be, put, be honest, I'm, I'm not a fan of, of these cards. I can't say I, I particularly like any of them. Unless you're particularly going to go for blunt damage, in which well, Paul seems okay. Yeah, I, that was the thing, right? Last time, because he starts with all uh, sword damage. And so last blunt, time I played, I was okay. kind of avoiding the blunt damage, but then all the cards that I got were all blunt damage. So it was like, uh, maybe I should have just... Yeah, and I guess you can always take them out later on when we get to the next town. Let's take Paul. Uh, so north, I guess. Oh, we're gonna have to choose between water mill on the hatch. Oh, I don't mind. Crops on fire near the farm. You come across a burned field and a burning house. In front of the house, there is a fire imp causing fires next to some burning cornies. Even half burned, the house may contain something valuable, but you'll have to deal with the fire imp and cornies first. You can deal with the imp and investigate the house or ignore him. Combat attack the imp head on. Oh. Sorry, go ahead. I was just going to say, I, I recommend that we do not take Evelyn's I'll option. take Evelyn's because option, because you got 5% success probability. Old cards, yeah. <laughs> yeah, okay, I'm, I'm cool with that. Uh, hiding the cornfields, taken by surprise, 78% chance. Sneak away, continue your way without attracting the imp's attention. Uh, I don't know, I think we, we surprise him. Surprise them, yeah. 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 Yes, critical success. Nice. You have no problem hiding in the cornfield without him seeing you. When he, when he least expects it, you come out of the shadows and give him a good blow. The blow is so strong the imp dies on the spot. All right, okay. There are only two surprise cornies left, but before they recover from the surprise, you proceed to finish them off. And considering we dealt with three <laughs> cornies yeah. last time. They are burning as well. That's cool. Yeah, we just need your weak weapon again. Yeah, that, that's uh, not going to happen this time, unfortunately. <laughs> and I can cast all of these. It's weird, I can't see your energy. It's under my character. Oh, right, okay, yes it is, okay. as well do that. Uh, he's down to eight. He will not die unless I hit him. Uh, let's do that. What's he doing? Front here, I deal 11 damage, apply three burn. Uh, I'll, I'll be honest, I think he's going to be dead by then. If you hit, you've got Oh, uh, yeah, because, yeah, 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 yeah. Okay. What, what damage are you doing with fast strike? Nine. Nine, so that's yeah. 18 and then plus so six 20, and bleed 23 sure but, and then yeah i think we should be okay now he's really burning come on reginald it lies down that five damage for free you want to do it first uh, and six and he's dead nice oh nobody needed healing right yep. uh, oh better version of charge 
I don't quite understand. I got a I got an upgraded version of Slice apparently, which does less damage than the versions of Slice that I have on my deck. Ah, uh, but it's free. Yes. Oh yes, it is. Yes. Well spotted. Uh, charge innate. Is that helpful having charge innate? <sighs> Not, not really, right? Not really, not really. But I mean, I mean, I guess he gained fast, but normally Magnus goes before. He's pretty, yeah, he's pretty fast anyway, right? Just before anybody else. Yeah. Uh, well, yeah, it normally goes Andrin, Magnus, and then whoever else. But it's sixty damage. I don't know. Let's take it. How do you feel about Curse of Elements? It's two mana. To apply... It's 14 damage, but it applies five burn, five chill, which is basically one slow. Slow, yeah. And plus the lightning. Seems pretty good. Yeah, I think I may take it. And then... I'm going to take shards. Um, Black Karma, 7 damage for 1 and 3 Dark. What does that do? I mean, dark's powerful, but you need to have a lot of cards that kind of pile the, the charges on the, to, to get it to 25. Kind of... I guess it gives Shadow, it reduces Shadow resistance as well, so it makes Shadow cards do more damage. But at the moment, we don't have any shadow cards. You do, you just pick Curse of Elements. This is true, but would you pick that card based on me having one shadow card? No, but we could start to potentially build towards it. Yeah, I suppose, I suppose. Or, well, yeah, or what the other options? Another Dawnlight? Uh, a Sacred Bolt? Sanctify, early resistance, minus 1% per charge. The attacker heals one hit point per charge when the target is hit. Mm, that's not bad. I don't know. You close your eyes and click on one. <laughs> uh... Did you wish help with pick a card? Let's take Black Karma. It's one. The burning House. You are at the entrance of the Burning House. Clearly this was a poor man's house and you can see the contents inside are already destroyed or burned. Before you leave, a chest catches your eye, although the chest is still on fire. The fire is spreading rapidly and there will be nothing left in a few moments. Will you venture into the flames for a poor man's chest? 68% chance that we succeed. How do you feel about that? Two and three chance. I, f I feel like it's trying to throw us off the scent by saying it's a poor man's chest. I think we'll, I think this poor man had some amazing artifact from his prior adventuring days. I Let's think we go should, for it. We should leave. Let's go for it. <laughs> we need four or higher. Yes. yes. Come out safely with the chest, although it's a bit burned. 40 gold, 56 experience. That's it? No. He was a poor man. Oh no! Item rewards! No, this is the part where it becomes important. I've no idea what the burned items do, if anything. Um, huh. But I don't know if you have any interest in any of these items because I don't think I you do frost damage do. don't you the icy you know, one could fire, fire fire damage uh, fire okay I may, I may take the spy glass just for lack yep. of other options to take and you've already got bandages and things mm -hmm. Yeah, 
why would I want a burned item? That's weird. Uh, the ring, all resistances, plus 3%. Andrin could have that. Would Andrin rather have that? I mean, Andrin could have it, but it, it, it's going to be between the, the, the two of us because it's... I, I would probably say Magnus is better off taking it because Magnus takes more, more hits. From... More hits and it's all resistances. Yeah, okay. Um... So, yeah, it probably works out better that way, I think. Okay, cool. Uh, Reginald. Uh, well, I guess I can give him Skull Rope. Yeah, that's pretty good for him. Sure. Uh, that was a pretty good chest. Indeed. Shall we proceed south? Uh, yeah. Obelisk corruption. Ooh, hello. hello. The obelisk's influence is corrupting the monsters in this area. You can choose to fight them under the effects of corruption to increase the difficulty and gain additional rewards. Uh, all monsters gain holy damage plus two, holy resistance plus 20%. All heroes suffer nine sanctify where i thought that was i thought sanctify was a good thing but no every time we're hit the enemy heals but but it's only combat start and every time the heal happens a uh, stack of sanctifies removed that's nine stacks of Sancti sanctify there yeah but over over the four characters it's 36 plus one's gonna drop off every turn presumably Sure. <laughs> obviously, kind of spread out. Like, and I, I, I like the I like the chances and the damage resistance. I guess isn't too much of a big deal because Reginald's normally, at least so far, kind of mopping up at the end of the game. So most of the work's already done by that point. Right. Sure. Um, well, how does this work? We have to pick. So we we say accept the challenge and we pick a reward. Yes. Uh, rare equipment See, shop. Upgrade altar. I'm not sure how I feel because I'd like the rare equipment shop, but I don't have much gold. Yeah, and we've also but, we've all got quite a lot. Of, I mean, we may get better equipment, I guess. But what does the upgrade yeah, altar do? Oh, upgrade, upgrade a card. card. But I can't mm. remember if that's free. It doesn't say that it's free, so I don't think that it is. It is just an upgrade altar. So you would still have the same kind of cost to upgrade your cards. Uh, I mean, I've got 408 gold, so I can I can share that as well. I don't know. I, yeah, I, I'm, I don't I'm, mind I'm one leaving, way or the other. I'm leaving this decision up to you. <laughs> you're leaving you're, this to you're me. The, you're the pro streamer. Yeah. Oh you. my god. Uh, this is this is this is on you. And it gives <laughs> me somebody to blame later on when it goes wrong. <laughs> okay, fair enough. Um. I think the upgrade altar. Oh, so it ticks the X of the challenge box, all right. All right. Is it just this fight then that applies to? Yes. It is just this fight, yes. Okay. Two corns, two farmers. Oh, hello. I got a soul blade. Um, okay, okay, so five. Hmm. Hey, Game Familiar, how you doing? <laughs> Are you ready to join? Milk Carton Girl, how's it going? I think... Happy New Year, everybody. Yeah, I think this. Oh god, you killed one already. Good, good, good. Hi, 
and I'll cut. Cool. What are they doing? Popcorn burst, random hero, deal six fire damage, or oh, repeat two. Yeah. Apply one water. That seems all right. <laughs> are you watching chat, Fat Heat Milk Cat? Old Cat Girl says hello. I am. I am. Okay. Um, Tell you what, that charge is just quite nice. 18 damage. It was quite a nice one. It is. Yeah, okay. So, uh, That'd be especially nice if we can get some sort of, um, you know, the, the crack armor thing or, or whatever it's called. It, yeah, to I increase think. Increase blood damage. Uh, yeah, uh, pom is it Pommel? Pommel's got that, I think. Yeah, yeah. Um, I think I'd better barricade. Yeah, yeah, I would say so, yeah. Even pop And then you may as well intercept yeah. for yourself as well. Uh, sure. Although, yeah, okay. Done. Although you may kill Unbelievable. <laughs> yeah, it's all right. All blocked. Well, where, 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 where did that? Where did that thirty health? Where did that come from? Jesus! What? He's back to full health. What? Oh, oh, oh! Sacred ground. What? It's but what? It's sacred ground do. The uh, thing. The oh, they heal nine hit points. Pain. Yeah, oh god. Oh, that's fine. We've got this. We've got this. <sighs> oh, they've also got resistance to my smite now as well. Um, Whose intents do we want to see? Corn on the cop? Mm, maybe. Although, actually, but it's got three sight on them anyway, so. Uh, on them. Yeah. Just... Pop it. Mean, put in the yeah, back it's guy. Worth, it's worth doing it anyway, yeah. It's free. Um, if anything, even if the damage is crap, it's worth focusing on one enemy at a time to yeah. minimize how, like, we can't just have them healing yeah. back to full every round. Yeah, I'll just focus on the front. Oh, for some reason that was doing more on the other guys. Okay, well, do that. There's three of you us going before they go again, so. That sanctifies nice if we can get it on everybody. Uh. Mm. I'll probably get used to this. I like to put it on. Magnus because he always he's always going after yeah Andrin so there's no point in putting it on me and obviously if I put it on you it's a chance to finish the game so I should keep uh, my attacking soon. cards get rid of my defense I will keep in rage and uh, yeah yeah oh a free sword blade was that your weak blade. weapon again <laughs> Yeah, yeah. Well, these, these weak weapons seem uh, seem pretty good. Okay, so in rage, uh, can we kill? Well, Evelyn's going. So, what are you doing? Actually, hang on. Deal ten damage to the front hero. Oh crap. Uh, I better put some block on then. Okay. You think we're gonna kill the front like... one? Yeah, easily. Okay. I like the idea that you that you were in rage and get really angry and draw a shield. <laughs> uh, there's no point in me putting this on anybody other than me. So yeah, okay. Both front 
enemy. Sacred ground, okay. Well, I mean, it doesn't matter. You, nobody you needs got... to heal anyway, right? I got yeah. healing rains, good enough. Uh, do flash. And I guess he seems Iron to attack the front necklace, one. Yeah. yeah. Uh, could just save that energy. I would all he'll carry over to the next round. Unless he, no, yeah. unless we're gonna kill him before then, in which case I um, could heal, but... There's no point in healing though, the only thing you'd be healing is... I it's only two, but... I want to Andrin and we'll heal at the end of the game anyway. Oh, that's true, that's yeah, we got our five heal, right? Yeah. Yeah. yeah, okay. And obviously we've basically got three goes before. Yeah. Then and now. Alright. Multi shot, not randomly. so good. No, unfortunately not. Uh, okay, he's slowed Ooh. down already. Although, I'm on charge. Might as well do that. Uh, yeah, so. Pommel first. Then charge. Down to six. Gone. Great. Our performance is dropping off. We didn't win in the first round that time. Another charge. I mean, it's, an, it's another... It's another blunt thing. Although punch yes. is free, but it's not much damage. And it's, yeah. I mean, it's... I guess I guess it's a cost thing. Like free cards are good, but for your deck. Yeah, exactly. For for two extra, for two energy, it's it's three times the damage. Yeah, yeah. Let's take another charge. Now I do quite like sword tooth knife. I think I'm gonna have to take sword tooth knife. That looks pretty good. One cost, fifteen damage, six bleed. Jeez. And I'm gonna take shards. I'm also, whilst you pick your last card, gonna have a tinkle, so I'll be one moment. <laughs> okay. Uh, oh my god, I gotta make my own decision. That feels weird. Uh, shield of warding. That is pretty chunky block and shield. Ray of Hope, two courage, mind holy and shadow resistance plus thirty percent, and heal seven. And dispel any darker, another healing rain. Although it starts out as global, six shield of warding. Altar. Okay, so this was our reward. So uh, we can upgrade stuff. Do I want to upgrade? Yeah, we are paying. Uh, 18 damage. 2 speed. Feels better than the innate version. Uh, the speed's not usually useful for Magnus, because, yeah, he is faster than most enemies, but sometimes that is good. So let me upgrade that. Uh, Reginald. Can we make this better? The light. Oh, currently Dawn light is a one use card. I didn't realize that. Mm, could get rid of that for 180 shards. 
probably smite up the damage. The damage a lot. I guess I've returned, by the way. I guess the other thing with Dawnlight is if you upgrade it the other direction, it adds a cost but adds damage to uh, all, all monsters. monsters. But it's never going to be high damage. Yeah. You're never going to have 20 cards in your hand. No. So it's... Yeah. Tricky. Do you have stuff that you want to upgrade? Because uh, I can give the shards to you as well. No, right? no, 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 no. You keep your shards. I might as well share them between us. Shield of warding. Can't reduce the cost. 22 shield and 14 block. God. That is pretty good. What's this? Vitality. Gain hit points and maximum hit points. Plus 5 per charge. But just temporarily, okay. Um, hmm. Last time I felt like I was kind of short on the healing. So boosting the I healing is useful, but... I think Reginald is just kind of short on healing in general, to be honest. Yeah, it's, his stuff is quite weak. Even upgrading it only adds, like, two heal. There are some cards I want to upgrade, but it's like 1,000. Um, really? Jeez. What do you call them to still great and yeah. That's a lot. A Li little bit much. A little bit yeah. out of my budget at the moment. Well this is only 60 shards to upgrade, so let's do that. Uh, I mean 60 shards is nothing. It is when you only have 67 shards. <laughs> oh yeah, that's true. I am kind of swimming in it, I guess. Let's upgrade one of the heels. Um, Maria. You sure you don't want any shards? Yeah, it's fine. Okay. I like to think that I make up for a lack of shards with a, a superior amount of skill. <laughs> this is probably well, that's true. What, that's, what I, that's what I like to tell myself, at least, anyway. <laughs> it's, it's not true, but, you know. Uh, we could upgrade. We could upgrade Pommel for only sixty, uh, from eight damage and one. What's that crack? To eighteen damage and two crack. The cost so also goes up to cost, two. Yeah. Although that's that seems pretty good because you've more than doubled the effect. This is true. This is true. Or what's the what's the options on charge? Can you reduce the cost on charge or... Uh, charge... It looks like you've already upgraded I've charge. upgraded one, yeah. Uh, we can, no, we can't reduce the cost. Oh, they're both upgraded actually already. I think I probably got one that was already upgraded. Um... Yeah, you can't reduce the cost on charge. I don't know, like, there's always got to be a kind of balance. I, I, I'm normally hesitant to to do that just on the basis of how difficult the energy is to come by. Right. Leave it at that, maybe. Well, Save the shards for later as well. Yeah, I mean, it's your call. Like, this is just this is my opinion on... Yeah, I, I'm always kind of just a little bit hesitant because of how hard the energy is to come by at the moment. Right. Uh, I don't know if you agree or you have an opinion on it. Yeah. Ooh. Yeah. Well, that is, that is a big upgrade. What are you wooing at? Intercept. Oh, right. 5 to 14. Or even... I mean, it costs one, but it's that's a big. It's equivalent to your defend, but you can throw it on somebody, somebody else. Somebody else, yeah, yeah, doing so one of those. You just have the, the one. It's, yeah, it's, yeah. Okay. Um, I didn't realize Dawnlight vanished as well after it had been played. 
Yeah, I, I would still lean towards the left upgrade. Certainly to make it reusable. That. Well, yeah, because, I mean, it, it, it's handy if it's in your hand. A bit of free damage. Yeah. But, but like I said, across the across the board, five damage to all characters is like... Uh, yeah. I mean, yeah, if they have Sanctify on them, maybe, but... But they don't, because we don't have any Sanctify cards, really. <laughs> so... Let's do Dawn Light, and then be done. Save a few shards. The hatch. You come across a house in ruins, and inside you see a large hatch. You try to open the hatch, but it is properly closed. A few seconds later, a voice speaks to you through the hatch. Only those touched by the flames. The voice remains silent, as if waiting for a passphrase. Do you want to do? Leave. You don't know the passphrase, so you leave. Enter. Jumping on the hatch will break it. The problem will be trying to land on your feet. Oh god, and we got a different chance for every character. Uh, so I've, I've done this before. What will happen is you'll end up with a, a debuff card, which will undraw um, effect. It, it does like a certain thing. I can't remember what it is, but you'll basically have like a broken ankle or something. Oh, um, stainy deck forever. It, 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 no, you can remove it. You can remove it when you get to the town. It will right, cost something, but, but... Yeah. Okay. Uh, or we try to open the hatch in a safer way than jumping on it. 50-50 chance. I don't know. Yeah, what, what do you reckon? You reckon that one? Go on then. What do we need? Single one or lower? Okay, so one of us failed, one of us succeeded. Suffer two vulnerable on draw. But only lasts for a turn. Right. The Hatch, Kingdom of Synanthia. Oh, okay. This is cool. Little mini area. Silly gatekeepers, you are inside the hatch. Here you can see what at first glance seems to be a normal basement. But at the end of the room, you can see a door with three pigmen keeping watch. They are new to this place, and they don't seem very excited about having to stand guard. In fact, one of them is lying down and almost asleep. The other two don't seem to be very smart either, but they could raise the alarm depending on how you approach. What do you want to do? Leave? No. Combat? Pretend, act as if you were one of them, and go ahead. 50-50 chance. Well, they don't seem very smart. Let me try to intimidate them. 50-50 chance. Uh, I mean... I guess pretend has a 51% chance. It's better than yeah, Magnus I mean, option. Yeah. Do you want to go for pretend? Uh, what could possibly go wrong? We might get to avoid the fight. Oh dear. Fuck. <laughs> Your attempt to impersonate one of them has gone wrong and you were discovered. No choice but to fight. Well, that's okay, because we probably have to fight anyway, right? I, so. I don't understand what could have possibly gone wrong. How could we possibly not have <laughs> disguised ourselves as pigmen? <laughs> uh, okay, their mind resistance is gone. Okay, uh, I just played that on him. Uh, do we know what they're doing? It's not bad, bro, to be honest. Um, yes, you can click hide. So... Oh, it won't show. So he's dealing damage to a random hero, front hero, and random hero, it looks like. I actually can't see it. A mouse over it doesn't yeah, you, show you, it for you, me. You can't. You can't, unfortunately. Um, in fact, right right click, right click. Ah, and okay. It, show you. Right it only click. works on the, on the front one, but it looks like the back one's doing the same card. Uh, it works in the middle as well. Oh, can, oh, can you? Yeah. Oh, no, you need to right click on the card itself. Yeah. So we've got front hero. 16 damage. So, in terms of turn order, the middle one is going first, then the front one, and then the rear. Okay, Magnus so is still this going first. 16 damage. I mean, if I, keep, if I keep Captain's Howl, I can. Slow him down. Slow him down, yeah. So that'll drop him behind Evelyn. I should oh, yeah. probably keep a defend though. Maybe get rid of rent because it's not very much. I mean, it's a bleed, but yeah. I mean, I, that's what I would say. We've got more chance of kind of pulling a, a, a better card to be honest. Yeah. Um, 
think I'm just gonna have to, given that three of my cards are for front monster, because it kind of makes sense, I just kind of pile it on the front guy. I can't say I'm a fan of the noise that he makes. <laughs> okay, so that's pushed him behind Evelyn as well. But you should be able to kill... kill 18... Yeah. yeah. Wait, in fact, no, 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 no. No? You want to, you want to defend because you're going to take the damage? Uh, yeah, I can do... well... I would maybe defend yeah. once and then kill the front kill one. Kill the front one. Because you've still got Reginald later on, I guess, to heal the damage, and you're only going to take two damage. Depending on what my resistance... From the... uh, yeah, okay. Yeah, Yeah, but obviously plus the resistance, and you've got um, quite high resistance to blood damage. Hmm, so I can do 13 damage, or... Yeah, I mean, it's a no-brainer. I'm going to do more damage by doing it this way, I think. Yeah, they are different enemies as well, even though they look very similar. Worlds of Confusion is raiding. Greetings, greetings. Hi, well... How are you doing? <laughs> What's going on? Happy New Year! Lottie Shabby just finished doing some bedtime reading. Okay. I tell, I tell you what though, Phil, if you ever need somebody to uh, read you a bedtime story, just give Worlds a ring. <laughs> okay. <laughs> like, gen uh, uh, genuinely, like, yeah. Cool. Uh... Uh, Tiddy Witch says she just read the most lovely bedtime story, a man jumped in front of a train. <laughs> uh, okay. <laughs> Welcome, worlds. You've caught, you've caught us in the middle of a dungeon fighting pigs. Uh, nobody needs to heal, right? So, who's going next? The one at the back, right? We need to a random standard. hero. Okay. This is, this is a standard night out in Newcastle. <laughs> <laughs> Uh, should we just focus on the front guy? I can do slightly more damage on the back guy, but... Uh... Yeah, I would, I would say so. Just trying to burn him down, yeah? Yeah, I would say so, yeah. I've got seven mana. Uh... Yeah. And three heals, crazy. yeah. Uh... Maybe you throw a couple of barriers out and then... Yeah. Uh, I'll pick pick two characters and then it's the best that you I'll can pick do. front character and Reginald given he's got the lowest hit points in case he gets the random not because they're you, my characters are you back from your friends now Worlds I'm assuming you're back home now You got a taxi home at 4 a.m. <laughs> Jesus. What kind? What kind of? What kind of an idiot would be up at 4 a.m. 
Yeah, really? Jeez. Uh, can we kill this guy? Um, uh, I mean, within three turns, maybe. I mean, I'm putting on like no. 26. But I think he's attacking, he's attacking the, the lowest, the lowest, lowest points. HP monster. So it's going to be him. What? He's just going to heal himself, that's all. Oh, okay. Weird. Okay. Yeah, we'll, we'll dust it up until 4 a.m. and I have work today. <laughs> so, uh. Okay, let's do that. That, that wasn't that. Wasn't my, yeah. That wasn't uh, my, my greatest idea ever. Really. Block's not gonna matter, right? as well right it's free i never i never asked whereabouts whereabouts in the uk you were originally from phil uh near hull Ooh, hull hull so it's it's you know way up north that's not north. <laughs> Down south. <laughs> we don't south. <laughs> uh, I mean, like I go for the blood say, oh, I'm, I'm, I'm from, I'm from the north. I'm from Manchester. You're not from the north, <laughs> are you? Let's be honest. Come on. <laughs> How do you feel about Zap for Evelyn? Uh, not quite sure. Because it's free, but it's... it's What's chain. that kind of purpley... I don't know, smoke. but I like it. it. It does look, yeah, fancy. It's free? Uh, yes. That looks really good. Oh, well, but it's play once and then vanish, right? Yeah. Uh, dispel? Dispel could be useful, right? We should have that, I think. Oh, absolutely. Do you absolutely, agree? Yeah. yeah, I think so. I mean, it's two cost, but... Um... Can I look at your deck to spell? It's one cost. It is. One cost. Yeah, you, can drop a you can do dispel three or you can do... Uh, when it's upgraded. It um, ooh, you can do dispel two and grant one buffer as well. Okay, yeah. So I've got a little bit of insight on this because I've already been through this area before. Okay, give us your insight. So the top... Top root has an imp, a pig, and one of those baddies. You know the ones that kind of look like the jester with the red and black stripe kind of thing. Uh, okay, yeah. Yeah, I don't know what's on the bottom root. Shall we find out? Go. Oh god, obelisk corruption. Hmm. All monsters Ooh. gain max Hello. hit points plus forty. All damage plus one. Um, I think we know which which option we're taking here. Oh, we're accepting the challenge. The party will gain a load of money and shards. I see. Oh, absolutely not. Look at the dispel magic that you've got. Reginald will get that card for free. Do I want another copy? Dispel four and gain a buffer. Oh, Jesus, hang on. Sorry, dispel four. Oh, it's a special and version of the Dispel Magic card. It's not a regular one. It's a special version, and it's... Yeah, Dispel 4 and it gains a buffer, which prevents one... Um, one negative debuff. Right. Okay. 100% go for that. Go for that. Okay. And then even if you want to scrap the other one, then it, it doesn't matter. We've got this one. Right. 
Do you want to join Game Familiar? Are you originally saying you were going to join in? It looks like it's reasonably straightforward for us to kind right. of save and then... Right, so... I've never seen this guy before. This guy at the front is just a big boy version of the, the one at the back. But Stop. he's going to do Burning Javelin to one of the two middle heroes. The pig's going to do Blazing Strike to Magnus. We've also got an imp being summoned before the end of the turn. Um, I'm probably going to have to, based on, yeah, I mean, again, I've got a lot of front monster cards. I would like to take the one out at the back to stop. So yeah, you know what? I, I might try. I might try. I'm just trying to take down as much as I can. Right. Yeah, I'm all front monster. Um, I don't know what a firebrand is, but it's probably not good. 18 so damage from the pig. Firebrand gives you four fire damage, three of the flame debuff, and three mark. Ah, okay, yeah. But it won't affect you until next turn. But you want what you want to be concerned about is um the pig. Yeah. Doing uh, 18. eighteen damage. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Okay, so, so... Personally, my opinion would be 14 defense and then some attack. Just 14 defense? Well, he's only going to do 18 damage and you've always got Reginald at the end of the turn to heal it. True. Because my... my it, it, it's more like if you mouse over a fast strike, how much damage are you doing? Hey. So it's an extra 8 damage or save 4 HP and with the kind of equipment that we have you'll automatically heal 5 HP True. at the end of the turn so it's okay I'll just hit him but again this is just my opinion <laughs> feel yeah, free no, to no, do no. feel free to do things yourself yeah yeah yeah, yeah. No, that's, that's cool Count yourself lucky, Tiddy, which has got to live with this. <laughs> I don't think there's any way that I'm going to be able to take the back one out before. It's just cold spot. I'm going to fire him. And she's going to dispel the, um, the burn debuff, so it's worth me putting it on somebody else, to be honest. Although I can't play everything. Yeah, they've all got high fire resistance, yeah. don't they? Yeah. 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 Oops. <laughs> That's alright, it's only two damage. Oh god, a imp. Uh, anybody weak to shadow? Not really. Anybody weak to holy? Really? Imp's probably the best bet on the whole. He's only got ten percent. Um, Those two are the same. Gee, I forget. I can just mouse over the card, can I? Oh, the guy in the back's got evasion now as well. Uh, I'm trying to remember what game it is. I wish that had that mouse over thing. Five energy. Why don't I give some barrier to Evelyn? I'm just thinking Magnus is going to get to go before everybody else. He's probably going to have some block. He may have self block, so he can probably take care of himself. Uh, 
Um, expect so, yeah. So, down And then I get um, the self buff on the um, deflect. Okay. Uh, so, I'll put that on Reginald. Give him a bit of protection. Uh, I can't play everything. Do we just focus down the one we've been focusing on? I guess so, yeah. My kind of hope is we may be able to get him this turn. Multi shot. going to be the best way to do it because I can do 20 damage or 17 damage it's probably best to go for the overall damage for the sake of three isn't it um yeah because it does does it to everybody mm. and it takes off the evasion mm. of the bad guy as well Ah, uh, front monster, front monster, front monster. Of course it is. What are they doing? Who's going next? Uh, pretty much everybody is going next. He's not attacking though. Eight to a random hero, five to a random hero, nine to a random hero, and four to all heroes. He's going after Evelyn. Not. Those buffs that the, the, the second guy's gonna get. Uh, disgusting. That is pretty chunky. Uh, do I need. Oh, I've only got three energy anyway. I mean, I guess you could maybe take down the imp with charge and fast strike, and that's probably gonna be. Or do I need. we can do. Bend. Well, that saves us 8 damage. Yeah, we're not taking any damage from that. That's not much damage. I mean, the, the two uh, next turns are... Uh, yeah. Random hero anyway, so it's... <laughs> 11 burn? Oh, jeez. Dispel, that's a good time for Dispel to show up. But, uh, uh, yeah, I was the one light first. Light first. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Uh, and probably Divine Grace as well. Maybe Divine Grace. Oh. First. Because Divine Grace is going to remove all of the fire and heal for the same cost as Dispel. Ah, uh, okay. Dawn light. Uh, yeah, keep going on that front one. Holy smite, we can kill the front one. We should do that. Uh, anybody else want to dispel? Yes, possibly. Uh, in a while. Yeah, I mean, I, I was going to say probably shield of warding over dispel because. The spell's going to save you, what, say, five damage on you. Yeah. But you're going to have 11 shields left over. Although, I guess you would carry the energy over. True. So maybe... Only one I would energy. Maybe, I would maybe leave it and just scry and keep the two energy, to be honest. Really? Yeah, I mean... Yeah... Mm, I don't know. I'm still kind of nervous about what they do as well, though. So. But look at look at it this way. The, the, I mean, yeah, I guess yeah. That's sixteen block. Well, no, eleven no, block. Yeah. 
Yeah, no, I'm gonna I'm... do that. Uh, we can scry... Magnus, maybe? Hmm. I don't know what he would want to do, though. Yeah, I'm not sure. Uh, is it helpful on Andrin? Possibly, yeah. I might just get rid of these slices. Uh, I'll get rid of two of them in that toxic rain. Okay. Because I don't think four poison damage is worth it. Right. Spell bleed. Apply five burn. Heal for 22. Oh, God. Then he's doing the other one's doing fireball and summoning again. If only we had a way to slow him down. <laughs> uh, mm, 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 mm. Keep so one. we've got 18, 18 damage to the middle hero and 10 damage to the side ones. And summon fire him, so maybe keep one defend because Magnus might take damage. Yeah. Uh, maybe keep it well, intercept. For yeah, for Evelyn. The, the main thing there is the, the the captain's howl to keep the yeah keep the damage down. Uh, the speed, speed. down. Or do I take? I can do it on monster. Do I do the? Do I take on the back one for? Because so, I can do thirty-three damage. Magnus doesn't no, have do many 20, cards. That, I can do twenty-three damage. I don't know. I would stick on the front just because Magnus is. Well, cards Magnus mostly not, on the front. No, I, I, I get what you're saying. Although I guess we need to stop him doing this heal, don't we? Tall order, but nah, I think, I think we're okay. You think we can do it? Yeah, you've won. You've got pommel plus two fat. Well, mm. I don't know. I would maybe get pommel. Yeah, well, it's the fast strike's doing nine, pommel's doing ten. Yeah, but so I'm better off doing pommel. I guess, yeah, I guess, and then one fast strike, and then the two defends, probably. Yeah. Uh, yeah, one on me and one on Evelyn. <gasps> no, I did it the wrong way around. I thought this was on. I thought they were both any hero. It's fine, it's fine. Shoot. I wish there was an undo button. He's got it's six so, bleed. Got to do seventeen damage. It's six bleed and two burn. Oh yeah, so, so he's it's dead. Only Fifteen damage. There we go. Holy smites. And then, That's enough. Yeah. I mean, I, I don't know. Maybe just throw the flash on him anyway, just to remove any. No, I think you're right. Bleed six hit points at the start of the turn. Fire. Oh. Um, I mean, my, my I would still rather do the flash because he's going to heal for twenty two if we don't. Uh, do you no, because no, like, he's going to die at the start of the turn, isn't he? But I would rather remove any chance in case we've miscalculated. Do you know what I mean if if we're one out, he's then back up to twenty three health, and we've got to spend. Fair enough, all right. Do you know what I mean? Like, he does, it, yeah, just... he does have fire resistance. I don't know how that factors into the burn damage. Yeah, that, that's all it was, just to remove 
any doubt whatsoever. Just yeah. Just a couple. How do you feel about this front guy? I mean, I've really not got much choice but to attack the front one. I, would, I don't know. I was gonna say, okay. I was gonna say put the mark what? on the jester at the back just because that's more annoying. But that's cool. I was more thinking like all of my cards were front monster. What's so they doing? Four hero, uh, all heroes. Random hero. Okay, well, let's protect her. All heroes. Kind of feel like. Maybe throw one on yourself? I was gonna sit. Well. Because I know you look at it and, and Reginald has. The lowest more... health. Lost health, but you have the most health missing. It's easier to heal 8 health than it is to heal 17. What's Reginald's heal cards though? Heal for 8. You see, I've got to heal 10, which would be wasted on Reginald. Uh, so, yeah, okay. Oh, it's his heal. It's a defense self anyway. So, yeah, okay. Yeah, you can still join. Let's, uh, we'll finish this fight, uh, and then figure out how to do it. Um, quick, quick recommendation as well. Yep. Healing rain. Yeah. I know you probably... Sorry, I have a habit of pointing out the obvious. No, 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 no you, Yeah, yeah, you, you, no, never, you, you never, never know, know where people miss it, do you know what I mean? Like, it's, yep. uh... Yeah, sure. Uh, let's heal her. Uh, let's do some damage. And let's barrier. Uh... I would, yeah, I would scry one of the front three just to. You just want damage, don't we? Maximize just a chance to get it done in the next round. Yeah. Drop the defenses and then, yeah. Uh, yeah, I'll keep this. See, I do all the work, you get all the glory. <laughs> One hit point. Push him over. My little finger. Performance bonus satisfactory. Oh dear. Sounds like every conversation I have with Tiddy Witch, to be honest. <laughs> Steel skin, God. Headbutt. Helping hands, a very nice card. Spell slow, grant one inspire. Inspires, draw an extra card next turn. It's 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 just specifically handy for when you get to those fights later on where you get slowed down to just get rid of it and. It can kind of, yeah, it can completely change everything. Right. Oh, but I'm looking at headbutt. One cost, deal. Yeah. Fifteen yeah. damage. Blunt damage. Fifteen. Through. You have to discard a card, but you do. That, that's not really a problem, I guess, because normally you have a card left over. You normally. Yeah. You're, not, you're not playing every card every turn with Magnus. You, you know, we have something left over. Yeah. So, yeah. I mean, it's, it's your call. I'll, I'll, I'll leave it up to you. 
Steel skin is nice as well. Um, yeah, let me take headbutt. And well, my characters, I'm thinking just taking the shards because there's nothing that really stands out as okay. Amazing, toxic rain. It's three poison. It's like three damage. I mean, it's six damage over the course of three turns. Poison darts a random one and. Trace is similar to Scry, which you have, and whichever one I have, the um, Expert Tracker. Yeah. And then I've already got Ember Storm, I've already got Fire Blast. I'm just going to take the shots there. Okay, I'm going to yeah. take Bulk Hail. I like the idea of a Bulk Hail. Yeah, I mean, it, that, that, that's, that's pretty nice. Okay, uh, game familiar. So, I think what we've got to do, um, do you want to jump on the Discord? Do you, do you have a preference uh, for where you play game familiar? Reginald, then. Take Reginald, okay. So, that should be that. So, if we do begin adventure. Okay, and then we're back to where we were. Nice. So I guess it is kind of drop in, drop out. It's not quite as seamless as I thought it was, but it's it works. <laughs> Despite he'd need a timeout. <laughs> oh, okay. <laughs> not yet. I've been a good boy tonight, thank you very much. He has, he's been very good. <laughs> <laughs> Don't you what you think you think I'm not watching the stream like I didn't see that? <laughs> <laughs> it seems like you have a reputation, Damn. man. <laughs> cool. <laughs> okay, game familiar. So you just need to click on the um, on the oh, next I spot on the map. Them. Yeah, we all kind of decide where we go, and if we disagree, then we we have a fight. The bottomless pit. Like doc Doctor Zhao has the um, the pants icon now. <laughs> he does. Yes. Oh. Uh, moving next to the big pit in the middle of the room, you come to a ledge. Clearly those cultists are throwing something in there, but you're not sure what it could be. The hole looks really deep and you can't see the bottom, plus there's no apparent way down. Do you want to try throwing something? Can we throw a fatty down there? Fatty, go, go check uh... out the pit. <laughs> okay, we've already got divergent opinions. Uh, this is good with three of us, I guess, because then we'll never get stuck. Uh, leave. No. Well, unless I pick leave. <laughs> I can't, I can't. Uh, all right, what are we doing? Look, get closer, stay at the dark bottom of the pit. Uh, throw a group member into the pit. Fate will decide who it is. Oh, man, we've got to do that. We've got to do that. We're, we're going to throw somebody in the pit. Oh, game familiar chooses. Game familiar chooses. Oh, oh. Wait, is he choosing who gets thrown in the pit? No, he chooses, um... The, the highest selection card. Wait, but there were oh, two of us for one option oh, and one of us for God. the other. Damn it. Okay, that's, yeah, that's, that's good, that's good. Oh, who's going, who's oh, going oh, in the pit? Oh. <laughs> who's going in the pit? Reginald, oh no, Reginald, you went in the pit. <laughs> you did, you got pushed in the pit. Uh, it was random, so, so don't blame us. You pushed the unlucky one into the... Even though you didn't vote for, for pushing somebody into the pit, and we did. That's, that's got nothing to do with it. Uh, you pushed the unlucky one into the, into the hole. The drop is long, but after a while, he is magically teleported back with the group. Whatever it is like... Whatever it is at the bottom didn't like what you threw. This was an unforgettable and very traumatic experience. Uh, fail, you hear screams for a while and feel a little remorse, but just a little. <laughs> So, what, so basically what happened is Game Familiar has shown up and the first thing we do is push him into a hole. <laughs> well, like, wait, who the, wait, who wait, the fuck wait, are wait, you? Wait, <laughs> get down that hole! <laughs> it's a success! This is not... <laughs> uh, what do you mean success? Welcome to the team. <laughs> you succeeded in falling down the hole. Well done. <laughs> yeah, better, better you than us. <laughs> That's what I... Confuse me, it's like, but it's a success. 
Okay, the summoning ritual. You reach the end of the basement and here you can see many cultists in a summoning circle. The summoning has begun and from the number of cultists it does not appear that it will just be a normal imp who will show up. They become aware of your yeah. presence near the ritual and some cultists leave the circle to confront you. The cultist looks at you suspiciously, waiting for an answer. Combat! You respond by drawing your weapon and striking first. In familiar, you're very aggressive. Uh, pretend. Tell them you're here. To, you're new here, and we come to help with the ritual. Oh, 26% chance of success. But is there any downside in picking that and failing? Uh, I think we got a we got a a higher initiative if we pick the. If we just go straight in. Way. Yeah, I think so, but I don't know. Could be wrong. Let's do it. It's 26% chance. Oh no, it's disagreement again, so it doesn't matter. Yeah, as soon as there's any disagreement. It has to be it's unanimous or random, basically. I win! Uh, we need six or higher. Fail, oh dear. Never, never trust me. They look at you a second time and clearly see that you don't belong here. You didn't fool them and the fight begins. Oh god. These guys are tough. Yeah, it's fine. We've got this. We just fought like one of each of these and had a hard time. Admittedly with some other stuff as well, but... Yeah, I put this, so... Mm, so... Are those bad guys lower health than they were before? Well, yeah, because we had the... Um... the... Oh, the modifier. Oh, right, yeah, okay. Yeah. What did that get us in the end? You got uh, the, um, the the card, right? the the dispel. Oh yeah 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 yeah. yeah, yeah. Okay yeah 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 cool. Oh it's actually an AOE dispel, is it? Can I look at the? Can you guys see this? Yeah. Uh, yes, we can see when you yeah. Okay, my bad. Yeah, I can see that. Yeah, that's yeah. what I was looking at. Yeah, 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 yeah. Yeah, 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 yeah. No, sorry, that's Reginald Plain, so that's Fahid, right? So, no, we can't see what you're doing now, getting familiar. No, I'm not doing anything. Okay. Uh, headbutt, 12 damage. Uh, charge, and he does 13. Can, you... uh, can I pummel first? No, we lose three damage, but we gain one from crack. Mm. So I think that's worse. Uh, all I've got is attacks, though, so... And they are all front monsters, so... Kind of limited in what I can do. Oh, we've got discard one. Drop the fast strike, maybe? Because everything else is blunt. Uh, it is, but if I drop the charge, I can play all of the other three. That's a fair point. And you don't, it's not like you need the speed either. So that'll be 26. It, it would be 26, 28 actually, because you apply the. The crack. Does it stack the, the crack? Um, yes. Well. No, it'll be 26 because I mean, the crack applies to blood damage. Oh, and the uh, and the fast strike is not up. Yeah, and it, like I said, you you don't need the speed from charge, so so I yeah. think you're right. Like the extra damage that you would deal is is worth it. Okay, so uh, pommel, pommel, a strike. And I guess you're not you're not really losing that much because you've got the extra damage from the first pommel. God, how much damage are they going to do to us? Set me on fire again. And it works in our favor because I was trying to take a back one, but they're gonna do summon imp, and you can only have four. Ah, uh, right, okay, yeah, four baddies anyway. So, 
Alright, so <laughs> let's... It's that scream. Got a scream? I thought uh... I had a scream. Yeah, it was the, um... Okay, so what do the we want to discard scream. here? Do we want to discard any of this? Doxy Gray, um, maybe? Well, it's bad. It's not bad. It's good. It's funny, oh, wait there. I, I, can, I, can oh. see, I can see it now. Sorry, it was hidden. Uh, how much am I going to have? I'm only going to have three, so... Um, i going to get rid of those two. Oh, okay. So, and I guess we want to see what... So, they've all got force. They've all got sight from the pet anyway, but it's worth putting more sight on because it's free. Alright, so let's go there. That's probably gonna be the last one. I would definitely heal yourself with the rest, probably. Firebrand, thank you. That's why I was thinking it's worth doing enough <laughs> to get rid of those. Um, I might want to keep those defense. The rend, I don't. The front uh... two are, do are doing the the flame thing, the heat shield. Then attacking middle, middle hero arrow. self. It's only the back one that's doing damage at all next round apart from the front one and that's gonna be they're gonna be dead anyway well, here is yeah so i don't think i don't think you need to worry about defense next round to be honest at all well i mean it, all it's gonna be is seven piercing uh, seven seven range damage and three fire damage to a middle hero uh, yeah the three damages to all heroes right but yeah, but that the vote that that oh, that's, that that's gonna be dead. Yeah. Okay, all right. Um, so I'll probably um, drop the defense to be honest, and then okay. Oh, can, can you can you see the cards? Uh, if I hide this screen, does it hide it for you as well? No, no, cool. So I can I can see what they're gonna do. Nice. Uh, oh. do I keep rent or do I just go for my other? I would drop. I'm not a fan of rend. I'm not a fan of rend. Damage and, yeah. yeah. I mean, it's like it's bleed, quite... but it's kind of a bit slow. Let yeah. me keep keep one of the blocks and get rid of the rest. Oh yeah, good time for multi shot. <laughs> oh. oh yes, he's dead anyway. Oh nice. Oh, he's definitely dead. <laughs> So there's summon fire imp, but no sure. damage, I think, right? I think slow push them behind Evelyn, right? Yeah. 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 All right, cool. But we forgot. Uh, three energy. Yeah. I'll do that in fast strike. I could. Uh, yeah, that in fast strike, I think. Yeah, it's probably not going to be enough. No, but at least he's not attacking. Oh, but I get a turn before the other. Actually, yeah, which one is going? Oh, no. I'm not going to play this. Because he's going to get extra shield from the heat shield. Not worth it for the burn to burn down some of that shield. No, because no, it dispels it. Oh, right, okay. Yeah. Okay, so we got six. And. That, that bulk heals nice as well, though. So. Are we getting another 
I will play bulky on yourself personally. Yeah. I'm just a bit disappointed that there was no damage cards because it would have been nice to clear one of them out. Yeah. Fatty, thank you for the gift subs, man. <laughs> thank you, thank you. Uh, I don't I don't know maybe I would either heal or just save the energy for next round so I, I would expect that there's still going to be in the next round next round well, I mean, but if, if we finish it, then... Uh... Oh god, an imp. Yeah, it's going to be next round, isn't it? Monster, front monster. No. Oh, yeah. Uh, okay, what's we'll happening? We'll get it before it takes it. No, we won't. Damn. No. That's the only problem with Magnus, right? All these cards are front monster. Yeah. I mean... Uh, front hero, random hero, middle... Oh, God. Guess. Barricade. <laughs> Barricade <laughs> and... Fast strike. Yeah. I mean, he's not going to get that much shield, so I'll be able to take him out before much else happens. Greetings. Greetings, Ataku. How are you doing? Welcome back. Hey. If you if you want to join in, there is there's one free spot. Yes. Greetings. You are you are welcome to join us if you have a mic. Uh, should I put this on? Who's going to take most damage? Um. Well, I mean, the next turn is. Middle hero, Front right? Front hero and then random hero, so... Um, yeah, I think you're good, to be honest. It's free, it's free. The, the, I can put it on someone. Well, I mean, the max, that's got, the max that's gonna... That's 18 uh, damage, right? Uh, so, the middle hero. No, put, it, put, it on, put it on, um, put it on Magnus, because I've just realised fiery jabs from the next go repeats twice. Right, so it's three times, right? Oh, jeez, yeah, right. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh, yeah okay. so it's 18 damage, so at the very least, you'll cover yourself for any damage from the, the Firebrander. Hey, Cyrosis, how's it going? Tired. Fatty too. <laughs> Were you up uh, late for New Year? My sub icon is not pants. My sub icon is Bermuda shorts. Your, uh, your sub icon is pants. <laughs> it is not pants. <laughs> well, I, well, I, mean, I suppose, the, I suppose the, they are pants. But they're, they're special pants. Oh. You can join. You yeah, I mean, basically, are you sure they're not just Bermuda pants? You know, where like the bottom half of the legs have just disappeared for no apparent reason. Well, they are. It was a, it was a Bermuda triangle joke. <laughs> okay. 
Sorry, Ataku. Yeah, sorry. I created the event for... I think I created the event in the in the Discord for 9pm because that's when uh, Game Familiar could join us. Um, but then, given it... <laughs> given it's... What time is it where you are now, Fahid? It's like 1am in the morning, right? Uh, 1 a.m. in the morning. <laughs> so me and Fahid started a little bit earlier. So sorry, I completely forgot. I should have mentioned in the Discord. Uh, but yeah, um, hang on then. Let me uh, let me make sure you can see the voice channel. One second. Wait, you gotta kill the minions soon. Huh. Uh, Cyrosis, yes, up to four players can play together. Hey, hey how's it going? Hey. Let me turn yeah, up your volume. Uh, and listen. Cool, alright. Don't worry, I've been here for about two hours now and I've been in <laughs> the entire time. <laughs> okay, so I guess we need to finish this fight and then we can go back, right? Yeah. Um, yeah, there's... there's... We finish the... Sorry, go on, Phil. No, no I was just going to say, yeah, there's, there's no other way to jump in mid-fight, right, Itaku? No, no. Okay. Cool. Yeah, we'll, we'll have to take the fight again, Ted, so... Yeah, okay. All right. Just whilst we finish the fight, would you prefer to be mm. Andrian or Evelyn? Oh, I don't mind. You can take your pick. I think I would like to be Evelyn, since that's the one that I've kind of customized the cards on the most, I guess. Sure. It's only fair. Mm. Uh, I've got like two more defense selves. So uh, sorry, just, guys, just, I can't protect you. <laughs> I'll save the save the mana. Just, yeah, I would just protect yourself. You're selfish. Oh, I, you, you're selfish. Okay, yeah. Hey, I'm the one stood at the front what? here, taking all the crap that gets thrown at me. Are we on about the fight or, or just on stream? <laughs> Both. Fair enough. Okay, so do we want to kill now or do we delay to to heal? I don't think we delay, right? We get uh, worse rewards, right? Yeah, that's a good point. Yeah. Yeah, right. just kill. That would just kill you. Oh. Another defend. I don't need another defend. Helping hand. Do you have any preference for any of these cards, Taku, or do you want me to just take shards? I uh, could just go for shards. Helping hand or shield bash? <sighs> oh, God. Oh. Your call. I got another feeling going for the shield of war. It's like a block. And it's, uh, I can put it. Anything. So, again, for me, it's kind of hard to hear you. Are you kind of away from your mic? Oh, I think. Yeah. Okay, cool. So, it's using my phone mic, I guess, instead of my. <laughs> my headset all right so i could i think i'm gonna get, go shield of warding um, seems pretty good yeah it's a lot of block so you have block and shield right yeah so so at the end of the round Shield is applied on the next turn. Right. Okay, right. so that means that you get... If if you already pass your turn... And this is in relation to my turn or uh, the hero's turn? I, I'm, I'm guessing the hero's turn, right? Shield is applied at the next round, so... Uh, after everyone's done their turn. No, no, but the block. You don't lose the block until the hero's next turn, right? There's a block. Block end goes at the end of the round. The round is the. Once okay, every the character round is, is gone. Okay. 
So uh, that's kind of sad because that means because I'm probably going last every time. Oh, but the but we might have enemies that are slower than me. Right, and so. it's still but twenty two. Uh, the card shield. is for hero. The card is for hero, not self. Yeah, yeah I know. I can pick someone. Someone else. Too. You can pick someone. Yeah, so it, it's still a good card, I guess. Yeah, it's pretty decent. Yeah, well, because yeah, it's we're going last, to... you're not you're not really getting the the, the the block, obviously. So I would probably go for shards personally. I'm not sure I see the value in taking shield of Warden. And you've already got healing rain, and clarity's kind of a. Like you need to have. It's only really useful when you have a chance to dispel. Insane. And, and days, which doesn't happen very often. Right. Uh, no, but I'm I'm thinking that. I mean, if I'm going. I like the the zero point. I mean, I really have one. It's just that it's not upgraded, right? That's the one of the upgrade versions. Yeah, that's right, that's right, yeah. I'm gonna go another one of these, and then probably... But I just want to say as well, I've played 10 hours of this game, and I've also had a drink. <laughs> so, and you also up till 4am last night and got and up at 9. I also up until 4am and I've done oh. a 12 hour shift at work today, so <laughs> feel free to ignore everything that I'm saying. <laughs> but on the other hand, Ataku, how many hours did you say you've got in this game? You've played a lot, right? Oh, I, I'm pretty new. Uh, okay. I've been playing since uh, day one, early access. Uh, pretty uh, new? It's just like a few hundred hours, you know. <laughs> right, so, yeah. <laughs> we don't okay. need to go into specifics. <laughs> okay. So we'll just don't... do whatever you say. You could just tell us don't what to do. Me. And... <laughs> no, no, no. It's about, you got to learn by yourself. <laughs> I'm just here for the ride and to laugh at poor decisions. <laughs> Lord of the Imps. The ritual ended, the oh, room wait. filled with red smoke. Well, uh, uh, yeah, we, I, we... Yes, but... Don't well, we have to... Do we? Sorry. Day. Yeah. Do, do yeah. we want? To, can, can we bring Ataku in now? I don't know when. Yeah, you can back out now. It'll you can. Okay. Because it saves when you move to um, the next mode. Nope. We must finish the active event before exiting the game. Apparently. Oh. <laughs> you could alt F4 as the host if you wanted. Uh, but it, it will have saved. Okay. Let's, oh, let's, then... let's 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 just quickly do this. You can do yeah. that. Yeah. Yeah. Uh, the, the, the room filled with red smoke. So, uh, the temperature rose rapidly. You don't know if it went well or not, but the remaining cultists start to flee in panic after realizing what they've done. An impressive imp appears before you. It is uh, uh, that is a greater demon, Belfior, Lord of the Imps. What do you want from me, mortal? Although weakened by the precarious summoning conditions, you can't underestimate him. Oh. Uh, Temple take the bottom one. To be honest. Yeah, persuade. Maybe there's something we can do for you. 50-50 chance of success. Yeah. Game familiar? You want to fight him? Well, I picked that one before <laughs> realizing can you, that. Can you change? I don't think so. No? Let me see. No, it's not letting me. <laughs> I think it should wait it when, when there's when there's disagreement. Oh god, I've got to choose. Yeah, exactly. Uh, lowest card. So, I would... Uh, Closest card to two, highest card. Uh, which one is is game familiar least likely to win? Uh, probably high score. I don't know. I have like a couple of twos and don't. Well, actually, I have a bunch of twos. Yeah, for it. Fired one. I think. No, wait. What's he doing? Why is he trying it's multiple? Tie, oh, so it's a tie. It's okay. Just... Oh no, game familiar yeah. one. Okay, uh, I oh. guess we're fighting <laughs> the demon then. Who knows? Uh, maybe we, maybe, maybe we all die. We must be able to back out here, can't we? Uh, oh, oh no. Okay. no, we can't. 
Oh god, sorry <laughs> Ataki. You, you can't back out during combat. Ah, uh, sorry. It's fine. No, it's fine, you do. Good luck in the fight. Oh jeez. Oh, <laughs> this could be the end of the run. <laughs> <laughs> He's a big boy. He is a big boy. But he's, he's doing 40 damage to himself. He's also summoning two imps. Ah. Okay, well, let's enrage. Uh, He's not going to slow him down if you do that, but it will give him vulnerable. It'll yeah. More, which means I'll well, I mean... do more damage next round, and so will. Or should I well, wait until he's got imps really. and then it'll affect everybody? Well, no, because he's gonna. But no, I guess yeah, because the card gets destroyed at the end, doesn't it? I would maybe keep it because it's not gonna slow him down at all because he's already got a stack. Okay. Oh, yeah. Um. Yeah, so he's just summoning this guy, right? So we don't have to block. So let's crack first and then charge. And then fast strike. And then end. He's down to 300 already. Easy. 250. Is he actually smoking a pipe? I think so. <laughs> Let's not see what you do. I really don't know. We got three, so I'm guessing we want to know what the aims are doing. Yeah. So the the I've got a pet though, so the pet will. Oh, the pet will do it to everybody anyway at the yeah. beginning of the round, right? Yeah. Oh, okay. okay. I okay, guess so we get we kind of focus the boss because I think mm -hmm. in this yeah. kind of fight the boss will automatically end the fight when it. Um... Okay, so we're gonna go. I w yeah, I would maybe save the mana for next round just in case. Well, I mean, I'm assuming we're getting attacked, so. Yeah, it's essentially. It's a chunky amount of block. This is true, yeah, it's true. I mean, I'll save one energy just. The mirror has seven damage. <laughs> All heroes, nine damage. I assume he's got some kind of uber attack as well. Ugh, front monster. Um... You guys have got a lot of block. But I'm still gonna do barricade. Uh, it's 10 damage, it's 11 damage. that. Uh, do I need any more block? Uh, maybe. You can never have too much block. This is true. But you could save the mana, right? So. Okay, I'm glad I... I guess it makes sense to just kind of throw all this up here, even though it's only a <laughs> Two small damage. amount of damage. Yeah. Oh. 
healing rain. Yeah, I guess. Dispel yeah. fire, yeah. Oh, a fire again. Yeah, it, it'll clear it for everybody. Now do, no, um, do healing, healing rain gets rid of the fire off everyone. Oh, what I mean is like we got four, eight. That's a message. I would do, do healing rain. It'll dispel fire off everybody in the party. Right? And then it leaves you free to heal and holy spirit. Well, I don't think anybody... Oh, no, I guess Evelyn could do yeah, it. Evelyn could do it. Yeah. 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 I really enjoy this game co-op. Yeah, it's yeah. nice. <laughs> it's, so much better. it's so much better than... than... Yeah, just less to think about. Solo, yeah. 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 They should implement this in Guardian Quest, man. Yeah. Because... I mean, you can sort of do it, but it's a bit of a... Uh, 12... Oh god, that's my only damage. Uh, well then, yeah, I'll do it. Uh, right, damage-wise... Damage-wise, the, the middle one's going to... Blow up. Blow up. Yeah, so 16 damage to everybody. Freaking A. So, put one on... You uh, one and, Evelyn, and the boss is doing Andrew. forty to the middle hero, and twenty to the sides. Oh, um. <laughs> so the middle hero is taking sixty-two. Good times. Although, if that's Evelyn, how, how does it decide which middle hero? Don't know. Uh, I think it's random. Random. I don't think it goes lowest because the I fought some before and. Okay, well, so uh, that's self, so I've got to do that on self, and I'll put that on Evelyn because she's lowest. Yep. Can you use. Uh, oh, will, will that speed uh, Reginald before the. No, it's not. It's three, so it's, little... oh, it's only three. 13. Yep. I forget which one is the plus six. Uh, it's the green one, I don't know, it's called Haste, right? Sorry about that. There you go, have some speed. Oh no, Reginald's on 63. God. Okay, that could have been worse. Uh, Bulk heal. <laughs> yeah. Obviously, I'm gonna heal, but let's see. I got how many cards in deck? 11, right? X equal to your deck. Okay. And it, it tells you when you mouse server, right, what each one would heal for. Yeah. Uh. Okay, so are we assuming... Let me see what, what I have in the deck. I got all of this. Are we assuming that it's getting to my turn? Because I could just try to uh, dig for, for heals. So in terms of... Yeah, we're deck, probably not going to kill him, are we? In terms of decks, you've only you've got two heals. I'll put it on yourself because... Andrew only, yeah, exactly. has, Andrew only has two cards in his deck. Evelyn's, right, so, so, Evelyn's got so, eight. So it, it's not and I got, uh, yeah, and I got the broken bone, so... Yeah. So do right. it on yourself. Yeah, yeah. Huh. So, nice. obviously, I'm going to card this. I'm probably going to discard Foresight. Actually, let's just reshuffle and... Wait, 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 wait. I got 11... I'm drawing five, right? So I got 11, yeah, yeah. so... And right, you put yeah. two heals there, so you're going to draw at least yeah. one. Yep. And I think I keep the energy so I can essentially play all of the heals. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, it's, it's, it's nine, it's twelve, which, yeah. Hero 
20 damage and summon, okay. Yeah. Oh, okay. So... Uh, you, you know you've got both of the heals at least. So you don't have to discard any of them. It was just a free draw, right. if you know what I mean. Uh, wait, but we might want to... So you, you can what's just keep, the... all, you keep all of the cards, I guess. Wait, l let me see what's the last card in my deck. So that it... Oh, that, this is my draw pack? Did it's I reach up for it? It's different. No, that, that, that's you. Well, let me... Let me... Let me... Rage notes. Draw pile. Divine Grace. Oh, so yeah, I discard one so I so I can draw it. Uh, so I'm guessing we get rid of uh, Police Might. So I'm not gonna have en en enough energy to pretty much play all of all of it. So, although we might need the Holy Smite. Nah, no, no, I'm not really. Right, yeah. I'm healing. Right? I'm full healing. Right, so yeah. All right, so. That's my turn. Cool. And yeah, then I'm I can only really do one card, so. Uh, and that's that's actually good because that means that all the heals get reached off or back on next next turn in case we don't kill it. Right. Yeah. All right. G fifteen. Okay. Uh, do that and. He wants some block. Who's the lowest health? And, 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 or well Reginald. no. Reginald technically, yeah. Let's go. Uh let's start doing stuff here. So I got oh I got four? I thought I had more with Divine Grace first. Right. And we do it here. And we heal here. I think. Wait. What do I heal myself? I don't think I need to heal myself. These guys are attacking a lot of middle, so. Oh wait, wait, wait. I can I can I can hit before. Hmm. Because it's twice in hand and this is buffer, handful effort, or charge. Okay. So we go here. And dispel magic could be good on you, uh, yeah. Yeah. Uh, dispel and. Alright. That's the. What a terrible hand of cards. <laughs> yeah. Down to 53. Although I'm gonna be no help. Hmm. Hmm. Ooh. Sort of damage. <sighs> Always front monster. Uh, I can kill and I can't put any block up. What's he doing? Lose 40 hit points, summon all heroes, 18 damage. I mean, he's on 41, so... So Evelyn's mm. not going to kill him there, right? Well, no, he's going to lose 40 HP. Oh! And I've still, I've still got a turn first. Oh, okay. So we are all right, then. Yeah. So, they're, yeah, they're dead, right? Uh, and will that end when he dies, or do we still have to kill the imp? Just kill the imp anyway. Yeah, let's kill the imp, just in case. Just like, put some defend on me just in case. Okay, I'll trust you guys. I mean, I'll do this just in case, but... Do, do they play from left to right their cards, or...? Yes, looks like it. Sweet! Okay, performance, good. Uh, uh, I cost one piercing how? I guess we pick these first and then you... Uh, yeah, I'm not quite sure. 
this can do. Uh, uh howl again. Oh. Yeah. Howl is pretty good. I do like howl. Uh, it's not the upgraded version, but. Right. What's the upgraded version? Uh, zero cost or? Mm, uh, upgraded is yeah, zero cost. Just slows. Oh, there's another. Right. There's another version, right? Uh, yeah. Or one cost. Uh, all monsters applies too slow and one. Oh, that's the one I want really. But. Right. Um. Yeah, we'll take it. Okay, so now we can exit out. A great feat. We still must finish the active event. You've defeated a greater demon. Yeah. You just have to be on the map. Like, choosing right. where to go. Okay. Although he is not dead, he returned to his plane of existence and will take time to recover. Still, it is a great achievement and must be celebrated. There should be some magic shards in the demon's remains, and now the basement is empty of cultists for you to loot. Okay. Yeah, what, yeah. what option shall we pick? Uh, you collect all the magic shards. You also found a hidden chest near the summoning circle. One of the greater demon's horns remained after the fight. You take as a trophy and proof of your deed. You open the chest and rest for a while. Yeah, so I got a chest. Ooh. Nice. Ooh, okay. Uh, so do I have a weapon? Heal done. Zero. So everyone pick one? Like the entry war? Or this is just the one? Everybody gets to pick one, yeah. Also, in answer to your question, Phil, it was a pipe. It was a, it was a pipe. Do. Belfield's pipe. Can, we yes, can have it. His pipe. <laughs> can you right click and see what um, Searing Nova does? Yes. All monsters deal 5 damage, apply X burn, X equals your burn. Ooh. So we need that and Searing Dagger goes a free card. Yes. And that small pouch is really nice if. Anyone wants to replace a uh, small weapon? <laughs> oh, I think I, I might go Silver Chalice, right? That improves the heals plus one. Yeah, plus one, that seems like good for you. It's worth taking because you've got a free slot anyway. Oh. And does it multiply the excess or is plus one? I think it's just plus one. Oh, okay. Um, no, it's still good. What do I want to take? Anything? I don't... Think maybe the Searing Dagger? Because right now... You get plus one... Sword damage. Damage, and... It's either that or gold. Oh, and that gives me sword bow and fire damage plus one. I mean, you're not going to do sword damage or fire damage, but you get the Searing oh, but... card. <laughs> He does sword damage, I right? Do, yeah, he, yeah, I do, do sword, sword damage, yeah. You do you do, do sword damage, but what I mean is you're not gaining anything. I'm not, true, because I'm not right. doing ranged yeah, or fire range generally. Fire damage, but Apart from But, but you will also Nova. lose the inspire that you have now, which... But uh, what, what's your... Uh, random draw. Uh, yeah. What's your ring? What's your ring? Uh, resistance is plus 3%. Is that better than the plus 1 speed? Well, Magnus normally He's goes... He's pretty fast early, anyway, right? yeah. Yeah. Oh, okay, fair enough. And I would probably, I'll be honest, I would probably take the gold because Evelyn has an empty spot for weapon and she'll gain the fire damage. And right. The fire okay. damage will help with the fire spell. Yeah. Yeah, it's fine by me. That's pretty good. Yeah. Right, gold. And I'm gonna go with Chalice, I think. Yeah, because the other ones are... Yep. Ah. And I think even though it's pointless, it makes sense for me just to take the emerald necklace because I've got a free spot. Yeah, might as well. <laughs> I mean, it might not be pointless. You might be fighting might be a monster that's yeah. really fast. Slow. So, so do you okay. want to exit out and save exit. now? Yes. Then, okay, yeah. finally. <laughs> Ten hours later. Okay. So, multiplayer, adventure mode, uh, this one, right? USA East. This is going to be unsurprising, but I do need to tingle again. <laughs> so, once, yeah, no worries. I'll go have a wee wee. 
Yeah. But it's not like an embodied fight here. Yeah, fight, he's found it already anyway. Cool. All cool. right. Wow. I'm um, liking this one. <laughs> yeah, I wasn't expecting to, to get a four player. I was joking to Fatty the other day. I was like, who knows three other people who all like to play the same game? Like, how, how could anybody get like four different people playing the same game at the same time? Yeah. Um, right. Well, at the same time, it's, it's the challenging it's, part. Yeah, that's always, yeah, <laughs> especially with time zones, right, as well. Yeah. Um, the game's Discord is actually quite good. Um, is it? With an LFG champ. Yeah. Oh, uh, right, okay. So, yeah. uh, who are you playing, Ataku? Andrew. Andrew? Andrew. Okay. Yes. Cool. Um, Level, I've leveled up. Oh, I leveled, I leveled up too, so... Sweet. Uh, the start of combat. Uh, okay, so pick an option. Add a copy of the card follow up to your deck. The next attack, reduce the cost of the highest cost attack in your hand by three. Do I have three cost attacks? No, but I might want to get some. Or add a copy of Wolfguard. All resistances plus ten percent when damaged by others gain fifteen shield and one of that. Three uses. You can play that on any hero. Yes. What do you reckon? Um, it's both good. If you wanted to be more aggressive, you could go with the attack. Yeah, I'm, I'm going more. Go. I'm going more support, so I I, I chose uh, focus heal. Same. Seems appropriate. Okay. Yeah, that that 15 shield when damaged by others is pretty nice. Uh, yeah, so it, it triggers any time they take health damage. Yeah. Up to three. Oh, times. so would that trigger if they like, took like they took bleed or burn damage at the start of the turn? Would that then? Give them block. Um, no, they, they, I think they'd have to take direct. Direct damage, depth. okay. Uh, uh, I don't know. Let's take that one. Oh, okay. I can do this again. Come on, guys, I've been waiting ages. <laughs> Leaving the basement. After having rested for a while and thoroughly inspected the basement, there is nothing left to do here. You walk through the basement full oh. of dead cultists. Wow. Do we want to upgrade stuff? Or. Um, I don't mind. You said. Do we have any plans for the path? No. Maybe go towards where the horn is. Oh. Which would mean we would have to go south to get there. Why is there the horn over there? That means that there's an interaction because you have the horn. Ah, right. Okay. Right. I, I guess mean, that, I guess that I would Yeah, that takes us through here as well, doesn't it? So, yeah, okay. Fine with that. The broken altar. You discover the rubble of an ancient altar. Those altars are used to make offerings with magic shards to improve your skills. The altar appears to be destroyed on purpose, and perhaps those who did are still nearby. The altar is barely usable, and in order for the offering to work, you will have to offer additional amount of shards. Try to repair the altar a bit before using it. 67% chance. 67%. It's pretty good. Uh, yeah. It's two and three, isn't it? Oh god, I fail. So uh, close. <laughs> Whose idea was this? <laughs> Who are these people? Just right, increase so... the cost by a bit, okay. Oh god, I don't have a lot of shards anymore. I spent them all. Oh, are the shards uh share? No, they're not, right? Uh but I no, you, but you, you can, can give, give yeah, shards. you can give golden shards. I've got 295, so if anybody uh, wants some, 
I mean, yeah. I could give mine. I'll probably save mine until town. Okay. So the increase, the cost is increased. Yeah, I guess I don't think there's anything. Oh well, hang on. Did, did I take that? What was that other one? Uh, the, the piercing piercing howl. howl. Why do I only see one piercing howl? I took it, didn't I? No, because you have uh, the captain's the top howl, one, which is captain's howl. Yeah. Uh, right. Because okay. I'm, I'm watching you as you scroll up, even though <laughs> several seconds behind, obviously. <laughs> so, uh, yeah. So all monsters slow for two turns. Cost one. Uh, or reduce the cost to zero and make them vulnerable as well. What's the icon on the left next to the cards? Is it the... Ah, that must be the debuffs, the, the bad cards. So I've got Broken Bone and Reginald has Broken Bone and Panic Scream. Yes, the injuries. Yeah. Uh, right, okay. Uh, let's Don't take... forget to remove those when we get to town. If we get to town. Confidence. <laughs> we'll get to town. Oh, of course. Of course. Wait. Okay. Is somebody still looking? Uh, yeah, I am. Uh, does, right, uh, does the max HP gain, that's just temporary, right? For vitality? Yeah. Okay. It's basically a 5 HP heal, but if they're full health, it also counts as a bit of a buffer. Right. right. Um, I can exit. The last sentinel, you arrive at a crumbling watchtower. This tower was the first point of defense in the wolf wars against the wild werewolves of the forest. When you enter the tower, your eyes catch a dim light that filters under the rubble. It is a golem. They were the best defenders Senenthia has ever known, but they were dismantled after the war and it was thought that there were no more left. The power supply seems to be damaged. Maybe if you can find a replacement for the core, you can repair it. You hide the golem and keep it more protected so it doesn't take more damage. Maybe in the Velkarath Mountains, there is some creature near the volcano that has something that can be used as a core. While you were hiding the golem, you found some magic shards. It's gonna suck for me if we're going that way because I've got all fire cards. Yeah. I can talk something out though. Story time. In the forest, you found a large open space that seems like the perfect place to rest a bit before continuing your journey. When you set up a camp, you realize that there is already another group of adventurers camping. They see you and offer to share the camp. One of them also tells you, hey, do you want to share some stories from your travels with us while you rest? Do you like to share his camp? Are they werewolves? Oh, yes. <laughs> Ah, oh, we don't know that. <laughs> you speak of your battle with the greater demon, Belfior, showing his horn as evidence. The adventurers are really impressed with you and tell you their own story. They discover that the that in the forest deeps, the dryads have a large stash where they keep all the items of the dead adventurers who get lost in the forest. Ooh, let's go to our stash. Uh, where, is is that somewhere else? Where Steeps is down yeah. past the shop. Okay. Hey, so Jay Mac, one? how you doing? Hey. Yeah, maybe down by the shop and then to the forest deeps and then to the boss. Because either way, we're going to have to fight. We're right. We're going to have to do one fight anyway, so. Uh, let's go to the shop. Forest deeps. Okay, time for me. The werewolf stall. Okay, I've seen this before. Come to lodge stone arch in the middle of the forest at one side of the arch. You see a stall run by a werewolf. When you approach, he says, Hey, hey! Finally, some customers. Come close and look at my wares. Half of these items come from the bandits. I'm sure there is something interesting you might need. Oh, by the way, I didn't kill that boy over there. He was already dead this morning when I came to set up the stall. Uh, yeah, we should definitely point out the dead boy. Just got home from work and have to head back in 12. Oh, oh. oh fail. 
My wolf growls and says, I won't repeat myself, the boy was dead before I arrived. You can look at my words, but don't expect any discounts. I want to buy a pet. So we all have the same items this time, at least. Oh, we do? Hmm. You've got that morning star for you. That. Yeah. Uh, how do I look at my deck? I think I... Deck. Do, do, I, do I want to swap the... It is essentially a decrease in 3% to fire, gold, and lining, but 7% on everything, and max HP for 260. I don't know, that's. Yeah. Probably. But it depends, it depends which way we go, because the next area has lots of fire damage, or we'll be going into the forest, so. Well, it's always an upgrade because it's all resistances. Yeah, it's all resistance. Yeah, 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 yeah. I mean, I could do the replace the ring, right? So it's max HP or resistance plus four, but then I lose the charges plus one in the uh, the eyesight thing. Right? I, I, would, I would go because I've got a right. Gonna, you you I, already I, got one of those, right? Andron has a pet, so every turn we get one side anyway. Right. Um, and, yeah. and, and. Yeah, that's, that's you, what you I'm thinking. You don't really cast. I mean, you've got. You've got. I got one. You, you, always can, you all already kind of get three charges anyway. Right, yes. From the card. Well, that's card. I mean, I could also keep the gold, or can I send the gold I mean, to. I, I can send the gold if you want to get the armor. And the and the the, uh, the jewelry. I'm not sure that both of them are. Well, I mean, because this is a plus two percent increase in resistance. That's not nothing, I guess. And the max HP is nice, I suppose. It's plus five. Yeah, for Reginald, that would be pretty good. Well, it's plus thirteen if you get both. Yeah, both. Hmm. Okay. Yeah. I'll... I mean, I'm definitely buying this. I'm, I'm not sure about the. Uh... So. Who, who's playing Reginald again? Uh, Game familiar. Me. Game, Game familiar, yes. How much gold do you need for the armor? Oh, a bunch. So. Like 230. So, yeah, that don't send anything. I've, I've got. Oh. I mean, I've got spare gold as well I can send you. I don't think there's anything. I'll just send 192. Oh. Oh, I can send back. How do you send? Uh, do you just click on the... Give uh, gold give and shards. shards. Uh, give golds. Oh. This is hard for me to talk to oh. chat when there's three other people in Discord with me as well. I'm kind of like, I feel like I'm going to confuse oh. people. I need to learn how to mute myself in Discord and then just talk to chat. <laughs> um, have you seen this before, uh, Chain Mech? Uh, who sent me the gold? So I can send it back. That would be me. Me. <laughs> Lies. I sent you it. <laughs> okay. I guess I just keep the gold there. That's a voice you can trust. <laughs> <laughs> Are you not gonna buy the by the weapon? I already, already did. It's just this, that this one. I, I, I've got I've got an equal number of star of weapons that are uh, oh, okay, sharp okay, and yeah, blunt, yeah. so that makes sense. Yeah. Okay. Just pointing out now, I might ask for gold when we get the town because I have none. That's fine. I can help <laughs> you. <laughs> okay. Yeah, I just sent the gold. Uh... Not to me, you didn't. It must have went to uh, to attack you. Oh. Okay. <laughs> Thank you. I've got the gold now. Who we're, who we're, wait, we're waiting for one more exit. It's fine. We, we don't we don't need. Uh, uh, we can just send the gold later on. You don't get um, charged for sending the gold <laughs> one way or the there's, other. There's no fee now. That would be fun. <laughs> uh, 
I'll lend you gold, but I've got a 32% <laughs> interest. <laughs> <laughs> You've got uh, three combats to pay me back. This is um this is a game called Across the Obelisk. Yeah. It's a it's a lot more interesting in the sense that it's a co-op game. So you can play it solo and control all four characters, or you can play it co-op and everybody can control character individual. Right. Or several characters even. Oh, it was or several um, characters, yeah. But yeah, the so, so the map here is is very much like Slay the Spire. I guess you're choosing branching oh. paths and then different events or combats along each path. Um, and then yeah, yeah the, the the combat is very Slay the Spire like as well. Yeah, the the map looks pretty, but it could so. use a bit more cr contrast be between the icons and the no, and the background because I get like confused. Right. Uh, yeah, so one, one difference, Jemek, uh, with Slay the Spire is uh, each of the characters has an initiative score, which is at the top here. Uh, so that determines what order we act in. Yeah. Someone made a multiplayer mod for Slay the Spire. Yeah. Um, yeah, me and Game Familiar played that once. Yeah, it was pretty good, wasn't it, Game Familiar? I, 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 yeah, I enjoyed that. It worked pretty yeah. well. In fact, that was yes, the only time did. that I've ever beaten the heart in Slay the Spire. That was when I played <laughs> co-op with Game Familiar. Sad to say. Yeah, th there's a little dash of Darkest Dungeon as well in that, you know, some cards can only target certain monsters. Um, so most of my deck is front monster only. Um, and then, yeah, some of these buff cards can either target any hero or uh, just self. Um, okay, sorry, what are we doing? Who's attacking? Uh, I mean, not that there's really much choice for me. I just hit stuff. Do I need to put some block up? Um, He's hitting me for uh, five. You're, you're getting pounded. Am I? Oh, good. <laughs> yeah. Awesome. Uh, it's the name. On, it's the name. It's the name block, of the attack. <laughs> block on me. Um, yeah, this is the uh, the mana over on the right hand side. Um, which eight, twelve, five. That's thirteen damage. Yeah, it's actually better not to use... He's probably got more blunt res... Oh yeah, the other difference is every enemy has a ton of different resistances. Uh, so in the top left right. corner there, there are nine different resistances. So uh, sharp damage, blunt damage, range damage, fire damage, ice damage, lightning damage. Uh, what's that one? Mine damage, holy damage, and shadow damage, I think. Uh, and this guy's immune to bleed. So yeah, so that affects all of the damage that your cards do. And every monster, of course, has a different set of uh, uh, of, uh, of resistances as well. But the UI is great because, yeah, when I mouse over the card like this, it shows me how much damage. Uh, so if I could hit multiple enemies with it, it would it would show me hovering over the enemy how much damage it does to that enemy. So it does make it easy to see. Um, so yeah, he's immune. To that? Yeah, they're they're immune to bleed. The the, the they, they are immune to bleed, yeah. Uh, which the, is, the dryad uh, from that. So it's like, do I do 16 damage or do I do 20? Well, That's right, Chainmack, when it's negative. So the Chunkies take more damage from... Slashing? From fire. Yes. From fire. Oh, fire? Okay. Yes, yeah, weak to fire. Ah. Oh, and they... <laughs> and they, they yeah. Who has a load oh, of fire? Oh. Burn the forest down. <laughs> <laughs> it's also useful to note that there are many ways to lower resistances, such as burn lowers their fire resistance even more. So applying more and more burn makes them take more and more fire damage. Right. Uh, cool. Yeah. Okay. Hey. Right. Mm -hmm. 
All right, let's see. I got five energy, and we can, I guess, remove the bleed. Right? This has. So you can see the energy the uh, the active character has underneath the uh, portrait here. I, I would still try and take out this Trunky because he's the only one. Yeah. On yeah. I'm, I'm I'm killing I'm killing that guy anyways. Uh, wait, this draws a card, so. Hmm. No, let's just smite to kill. Huh? Then I flash to yeah, draw a card. Uh, I think we're not gonna go. You could I think we're dispel. not gonna go. Well, well, yeah. You could dispel. No, I don't think this this is gonna go. Uh, too many rounds, so I'm just gonna do this. Imagine if you could play games like D and D, and you could see what somebody was going to play for the next six turns. <laughs> what is your pet called, Fade? Oh, that's actually not your pet anymore, is it? You know what? You know what? You know what I mean. <laughs> Like, you, you could see what everything was going to do for the next six turns, you know what I meant. Right. <laughs> My pet is called Akuli. Akuli. Like Oculus. Okay. Yeah, it's called Oculi. It does look like a baby beholder. Yes. <laughs> um, um, this pretty cool pet. Why do can't I hit? It? It's, the, it's the only pet that I've got so far. Uh. Yeah, they show up, you know, they're, they're not too hard to get, but some of them are RNG-based. You need the right events to show up. Is it worth doing barricade? They're not doing that much damage. Um, I, mean, I mean, you've got you've got Evelyn yeah. and Reginald before the Dryad, uh, before the, the Trunky goes, and the Dryad's going to die probably anyway. Right. So, yeah, you can just enrage and just attack, right? Yeah, that's what I would say. Mm, okay. I would, yeah, yeah, head button pommel. Uh, am I going to have the mana left over? I'm going to have... Do I have one left over? Uh, Two, maybe. I could do barricade, actually. I don't know whether the three that you've got left is already, you know, whether it's already. I, th the I, cost or I think but... there's oh. three left after this. Mm, maybe I... drop intercept. That's free second player anyway. Yeah, no, I, yeah, no. I, no, think, I, right, I yeah. think I'm good. No, you're all yeah. good. You're all good. Uh, sorry. It's, uh... mm. You can enable auto and turn, by the way, if you wanted to. I should probably do that, shouldn't I? Um, so this is... what is this doing? Gain... deal 5 to the fastest hero. So that's going but to be has, to... And... It, has, it has block anyway, so... Yeah. It's going to heal. And then... I would maybe scry... Well, uh, Andrin or, um, or Magnus. Right. I mean, there it's dead anyways, right? And everyone heals yeah. for enough, so... Yeah. And then...
Yeah, everybody heals. I'll say it before. I'll, I'll, I'll say it before. I'll say it again. We do all the work. I've got to take two thorns glory. damage to finish him off. Uh, yeah, but you heal back. Oh, I heal back I... anyway. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay, that's fine. Heavy strike, draw a card. Twenty-one. Oh yeah, I I'll get this guy. How do you feel about Geyser? Uh, Geyser. That ain't fun. Geyser, it will put out any burns that you've got on the enemy. Yeah. And I think you were going for a more yeah. fire. Yeah. So, yeah, we take the shots. Heavy strike, worth it. I mean, it, lo it looks nice, and it's a draw as well, but it depends how often do you find yourself with... Four energy. Three energy, right? Three energy, yeah. Well, and, yeah. Well, I suppose I could draw three costs. Uh, mm, yeah, it's a big attack. Let's take it. <laughs> the Dryads cache you in the deepest parts of the Senenthia Forest, and after clearing the path of Trunkies and Dryads, you went exactly where the adventurers told you. There is. The secret cache of the... There it is. The secret cache of the Dryads. The story was true. It seems that the Dryads used the bodies of the lost adventurers as fertilizer and kept all their belongings in one place. Time to loot. In addition to some items yeah. that are in good condition, you've also found some gold. Alright. What items? More we items. Got... Oh. Okay. Eh? Uh, hmm. is, is the order that we pick random? Yes. Just yes. in case we have a disagreement, so... <laughs> oh, okay. So... Why is this it's shown at the top? Yeah, I, I just... I think that... I think I'd rather have what this is, I can uh, improve the bandages, I guess. It'll be four instead of three. Uh, or I could take I, the gold. Yeah, I, I could take the gold, but... The well, the, the, the reason is... The, can everyone take the gold? Yes. yes. Okay. What? Well, 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 yeah, I was going to say, uh, Limey, you might want to take the bandages because you'll get two rather two extra. than one. Yeah. Right. There's, there's not really anything. Uh, oh, attack is taking it anyway. Okay. But I gained four. No. <laughs> <laughs> Even better. What will let you off? I didn't want the poison dart, to be honest. <laughs> Uh, God, yeah, I see. Well, I don't know. Do I want anything? Yeah, not great. Uh, is there bread? Yeah. The forest crown actually isn't that bad. Getting the fast, you basically always go first. Right. So this is the boss, right? The chapter one boss. Yes. Yilmer's awakening. The obelisk is in sight, but something very dangerous is blocking the way. Yilmer, an old treant once known as the protector of the Senenthia Forest, has awakened and been tainted by the energy emanating from the now active obelisk. Besides Yilmer, there is a Trunky and a Dryad protecting him. You can't see any way to avoid the confrontation, but maybe you can make the fight easier or worse depending on how you approach him. Challenge will be difficult. What do you do? Uh, really? The, the chance 25% probability of, of an ambush doesn't appeal? Well, the problem is that if we fail, I'm pretty sure. Yeah, I'm pretty sure it'll be bad. <laughs> yeah. Oh, well, this guy has a horrible beam attack. The moon gives some strength. Ah, okay. Um, are we going to focus down the, the minions? Or go for the boss? I don't know, what do you reckon? Well, I'm, I normally focus on the minions, personally. Yeah, um, uh, everyone feels. I think I focused on the they're... minions last time and then ended up very nearly dying. Well, yeah, I... I but I, I can only hit the front guy anyway, so, yeah. Yeah, so, I might as well. Does he summon? No. He doesn't? Yeah, he, he, does, tum he does summon, but not those. He summons yeah. oh, he summons small trophies. Okay. Yes. 
So once we get rid of these, then we don't have to worry about them anymore. Okay. Um, okay, maybe charge and shield bash. This is where fire damage again is super useful. Okay, so so this is attacking. Attacking anything, random hero. Everything random hero. Tell for random hero. Okay, so let's go middle. Um, I think I keep the energy for next time. Oh, this is mine. Um, hmm. I don't think we need heals just yet, right? No. Yeah, we're looking quite good. No, but he is doing a, a, a damage. He is doing damage to everybody next round. For this round, um, I mean, so uh, it's damage and bleed. Plus That's going to be after Rigil's gone. Yeah. Unless, true, true, what's the Dryad yeah. doing? Yeah, we, don't, we don't need the heals here, I'll take the damage. The Dryad will be dead anyway. Okay. Uh, okay, so I'm just going to I'm just gonna keep the dispel so I can remove the burning or something else. And then just re redraw the... G getting them back faster. There's nothing you'd be able to dispel. Uh, wait. Oh, because you're gonna lose the burning? Yeah, at the start of the turn, yeah. Uh, yeah, I'll stack, I'll, I'll stack up on, on defense here. Yeah, what's he doing? 10 damage plus 10 17 damage. damage to you. Oh god, okay. And he wants 5. Ah, uh, Andrin? Andrin, yeah. He's gonna cleanse this turn, right? I don't think he he's gonna dispel he's two, but he's, he's got poison, he's got a bunch of mark, burn, and sight. They dispel so, order. Uh, oh, okay. So he'll dispel the sight and burn. Yeah, okay. Okay. Do you mean it's maybe worth? Right, but it, but if you apply the the cold and lining, then next round you can apply the burn, and if it does the the same, right? It they go in a different order, or or is that fixed? Uh, are you saying if you reapply burn? Yes, I mean he's gonna reapply burn. <laughs> yeah, if he reapplies it, then um, it'll be at the end. So. Okay. It'll be less I mean, the burn's worth putting on anyway, just because of that. It goes first. Yeah. So we'll do the damage before he 
dispels it. Okay, I'm not interested in that. Uh, we're I probably think, gonna go. I think we're on for an excellent performance bonus, though. So. You can oh keep it. Here was last words. Is it excellent, the dark green area? Yes, yes. it is. Okay. I mean, we're on round two, and even if we get a round four, we'll still get excellent. Two of his cards are hidden now. This is the first time in the whole run that somebody's intents have been hidden. <laughs> what the? Maybe I should have played that. Um... I just hit him? Do I put wolf guard on somebody? I would just hit him, to be honest. Yeah, yeah he, he does have seven marks, so I'll just go for okay. as many attacks as you can. We full heal after this, I think. Right. Oh, nice. Wow! <laughs> Round three! God! <laughs> what a difference to the last time I met him. Wow! Gee, have you seen that card that I've got? I mean, it's cost seven, but... Ace Comet, deal 81 damage! <laughs> <laughs> yeah, that's a chunky hit. We've all got some pretty good cards, actually. Carnage is a, like, top-tier, like, attack card. It's a oh, really, really good attack card. Battle right, Plans so... is pretty good. It's free as well. It, that uh... Battle Plans would give you two energy of all, because it gives you two energies. Right. So... Do we want pulsing or renew? Renew the so regen. It's like what six times seven, forty-two, twenty something, right? So forty-two, twenty-one heal in six turns. Obviously, we're not gonna take six turns, but or this is um, four times four, sixteen heal for three. I would say renew. Yeah, right, yeah. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, it's, it's also less. Should I go for a song build? Or should I go like ranged damage? Up to you. That song is pretty cool. Turn lullaby, all monsters deal 25 mine damage. Apply five insane, two slow, and one days. Yeah. Five cost? You have a way of getting there. It is very expensive. I've never. I, I don't know enough about the, the, the song ones, to be honest. So, yeah, song decks are quite hard to build. You need to balance between cards that give you stamps, which allows you to play the song cards. And then you also need ways to sort of uh, reorder your deck or or draw cards so that you can get the cards in the right order. Did I got a 27 card deck? It's a bit more of a complicated style, but no. it's fun. You know, it's very strong as well. You can build like a support bard or a damage bard. There's, there's quite a few approaches to it. The path is clear. Gilmo will never wake up again. A shame that once a tall and wise treant like him has had to end this way because of the mysterious reactivation of the obelisk. Between Gilmo's roots, you see a large golden chest appear. Inside the chest, you find some golden shards, but also a good amount of magic items. Okay. Now I know for a fact you're looking at that flute. <laughs> <laughs> Well, it makes me wish that I'd taken it now, but I didn't take the card. Oh, you didn't take the song? Uh... Yeah, I'm pretty sure I'm, I'm taking the branch, but... Yeah. It's, it's a... 
it's an improvement over oh another advantages I don't know if I wonder if I should take the Gisela route. Uh, what I would con what I would consider yeah. is the shield. Oh. You drop four resistance for sharp blunt and uh, just sort of yeah. and, um, thingy, but you, you also get the, the thorns every time you I play, play defense. defense every, every time you play defense as Which well. Which I do a lot. Um, right. Yeah. Uh, it's twice a turn as well, so Yeah. And then when you consider you're only going to drop one thorns either when you hit or at the start of a turn. So if you just play lots of defense, you're going to build up a lot of thorns eventually. Right. Yep. Bye bye, mate. It's quite a good, quite a good item. Though. Okay. Especially if you can get an item with thorn charges plus. Right. Okay. And every time that item triggers, that would also gain that oh, increase. Yes. So now the obelisk. You are now in front of the obelisk. After centuries of inactivity, it is now brimming with energy, and its runes engraved in the stone shine brightly. When you read the runes aloud, the obelisk wall warps and distorts, creating two portals. One is reddish, and hot air comes out of it. The other is greenish and gives off a strong smell of stagnant water. The time has come to cross the obelisk. Where will you go? Well, our quest was in the reddish portal, right? Right, so you do have a quest in the reddish portal, but there's also a character you can get in the greenish portal with the horn. Oh, that feels cool. oh. okay, and, uh, and yeah, we've got fire damage, yeah. right? So, yeah, okay. Yeah, Across the portal. I would recommend doing that first. Okay. We can still get the second character if we make it through the act as well. Okay, cool.